This is me, and this is the one chunk I will be spending the next 100 days of hardcore Minecraft on. Will I be able to reach and survive the nether chunk and successfully enter the end portal and save the ender dragon? Well... Let's find out. Well, we've found ourselves stranded on a one chunk. And the only thing I can see around me right now is a birch tree and an oak tree. And there's lots of grass that hopefully drop us some wheat seeds. There's some flowers here. So nice for decoration. Am I right, chickens? No? Okay. Oh, look at these eggs you guys have uh, supplied me with. Thank you very much. And what was your names, by the way? I mean, uh, you know, how did you uh, how did you even get up here? It's uh, it's pretty high up here. So how on earth did you even get up here, guys? Well, I guess I'll save those questions for later. But right now, first thing that we're actually going to do is we're going to take some of this grass up, hoping that it drops some wheat seeds for us. Nice. So we've already got two. Let's hopefully try and get some more. That would uh, that'd be really cool. Oh, my gosh. What are you guys doing following me? I'm trying to mind my own business right now and harvest these wheat seeds. Oh, of course, you love wheat seeds, don't you? That makes sense. Well, these aren't for you right now, guys. These are, these are for me to grow some wheat, okay? So let me quickly break the rest of this then, like so. Come on, are you going to drop me some more seeds or... Oh, there we go. Okay, four. Nice. <gasps> no! Oh, my gosh. How unlucky is that? I mean, I really needed that, but oh, well. Hopefully, we get another one. Okay, well, that makes up for it, doesn't it? Let's just break the remaining pieces of grass, and there we have it. Oh, there's actually one here. Come on, please drop a seed, please. Please. No. Okay, well, we didn't get another seed from that, but we actually managed to get ourselves five seeds. So, so now we've done that, all we've got to do now is chop these trees down. So let's start with the oak tree. Chopping, chopping, chopping. And there we go. So we're going to continue to break this tree till it's fully broken, like so. And it's all going to come down for us. Lovely, lovely stuff. There we go. So we actually managed to get four oak saplings from that, which is nice. So I'm going to go ahead and place these just like so. Also, just one there. And now I'm going to chop the birch logs down. Last piece. And there we go. Nice. Some more saplings, some sticks. Good, good stuff. Do I collect it all? I'm pretty sure I picked it all up, didn't I? Yeah, okay. There we go. All right, nice. So now over here, what we're going to do is we're going to place some birch saplings down here. Let me just take those up. And you know what? I'm going to keep this one for now. And with the wood that we managed to gather, let's go ahead and turn these all into planks and then turn it into a crafting table. Do you know what? I'm going to put it right there. There we go. Okay, now we can actually craft more stuff. So we've got our first crafting table down right now. So how about then we go and craft ourselves a nice wooden pickaxe? I mean, is it nice? It looks kind of it looks kind of ugly, doesn't it? But oh my gosh, before I can even open my eyes, a birch tree has actually grown. So that's good stuff. At least we know our trees are growing. <laughs> and then with the rest, I'm going to make myself a little axe. So it's quicker for me to chop some wood down. There we go. And I think that's all I'll be needing right now, honestly. And oh my gosh, what the... Look at it. It's all just sort of spawned out of nowhere. But hey, I'm not complaining. More wood for me. So let's go ahead and chop these birch trees down. I've also got to be very careful that no mobs spawn on here because there's not much lighting going on up here. So I've got to be very careful for that. But I'm just going to carry on breaking these birch trees and hoping to collect some more wood, to be honest. And now it's just this last one left. So then all of the leaves will fall and hopefully give me a lots of saplings and sticks. So that'd be pretty cool. And there we go. So it's going to all drop down for us. Nice. So we've got some more sticks and more saplings. Cool, cool. Let's go ahead and plant them back where they originally was. Like so. Let me plant one there. Okay, that should do the trick for now otherwise we're going to be overgrown by like loads of trees but it's becoming night time now the sun is going down the moon is rising it's getting pretty scary up here now and i actually don't like it but okay we've got to be very careful so let's go ahead and turn all of this in actually we're going to turn half of it into birch planks why not we might as well just have a stack. Uh, there we go. Okay. Now we've got a stack of birch planks, which is pretty cool. All we've got to do now is chop these oak trees down, and then we can start turning these into planks. Oh my gosh, I'm so scared. Just in case, like, a creeper comes in behind us and just completely takes us out. This is what I don't like. But right, I've just got to be on my guard at all times. So I've got to have eyes on the back of my head. Come on, come on, hurry up and break these trees, because I'm so scared right now. I'm literally on the edge of my one chunk, and if I fall, it's all over. Okay, nice. There we go. Lots of sticks, lots of saplings. Let's get placing those back. Just like so. Let me plant one there. I'm going to plant one here. Just wherever I feel like it, really. No, I'm even going to place one by the crafting bench. How about that? Maybe to even give me a little bit of shade while I'm crafting my uh, my tools. Okay, and we also got lots of eggs, I've realised. We've got six eggs. And with these eggs, do you know what? Hopefully we can get another chicken, so... Okay, I got nothing. But, hey, it was worth the try anyways. Oh my gosh. Oh, look at that phase underneath us. It's like a little broken nether. Getting kind of scary now, honestly. But I'm excited. It's a new challenge, so I think we're going to do this. But yeah, oh my gosh. Is that a... 
Is that a chest? Yeah, okay, that's definitely a chest down there, so that's very interesting. Hopefully there's some goodies in there for us. But right now, we need to get over this night and uh, hope some sunlight comes out pretty soon because it's uh, getting really scary out and it's cold. I need to soak up some sun and warm up a little bit up here. It's so cold. But with the remaining oak logs we got, I'm going to turn them all into planks like so. And then that's about it for tonight, honestly. I think we've, uh, we've done a hard day's work today, haven't we, chickens? Okay, so the sun has actually risen and it's a beautiful day. Day. Some oak trees have grown, some birch trees have grown, and the chickens are still happy dancing around, you know, minding their own business and hoping that they actually do receive some of these wheat seeds. Oh yeah, you want this guys? You want this? Well, too bad, because you're not having it. But yeah, oh, there we go, another oak tree's grown, so how about then we grab our trusty wooden axe and get chopping so we can collect lots and lots of wood? Because, to be honest, we're going to need it. It's going to come in very useful for us. These chickens pushing me around. What are you guys doing? Huh? Go away. Okay, let me chop this down. Some of them should fall. Okay, not even too much. Oh, that's why, because the leaves are being held up by this oak tree right here. So let's go ahead and take this up right now. Oh, well, that's just great, isn't it? Let's go and craft ourselves another wooden axe. Like so. Okay, and let's finish chopping this tree down. Nice. Oh my gosh, no! So much to spare right there. And oh my gosh, hello, levitating uh, oak log. Give me those saplings. There we go. And, a, and an egg. I mean, I'm guessing that didn't come from the tree, but I'll take them. Still collecting some birch wood. And I believe we're onto our last tree here. Well, apart from those two over there. But let's quickly go and collect this last piece of birch logs. And then it should all just fall down. And then we should get quite a lot of saplings and sticks, actually. Yeah, nice, nice. So a lot's actually dropped. I'll take those sticks those eggs and how about we go and take up these oak logs as well while we're at it just so all the trees are down and then we can start planting back down more saplings so that we can get even more wood to grow we've got an infinite wood source right now and this is what we need to do in minecraft this is what it's all about there we go nice good stuff good stuff i mean some of it fell down the edge but that's no problem let's go ahead and grab our oak saplings and plant them back down where they was originally like so let's plant one there there maybe even right here why not just because i feel like it but right we can do with crafting ourselves a chest though so what we're going to do is let's craft ourselves two chests like so there we go nice and then let's go ahead and place these two chests right about here okay so now what we can do is we can put all of our supplies in here so it's not in our inventory okay just like so so now we're going to manage the stuff that we actually need so this wooden axe looks like it's about to break so honestly all i'm going to do with this is just get rid of it but what i'm going to do is i'm going to take the wooden pickaxe i'm going to take all of this actually i'm going to leave all of the oak planks inside and then take some sticks maybe i'll take 27 oak planks just because but that's about it i think let me just place that there sort those out okay nice well there you have it it's looking pretty cool we've got some wheat seeds here so what we're going to do is we're going to create ourselves a nice wooden hoe and then what we're going to do is about hmm, where should we do it let's go ahead and hurt down right about here you know near some water so we can actually plant down some wheat seeds uh where are those wheat seeds actually there they are okay so we're going to grab our five wheat seeds that we've been collected and let's go ahead and plant them there no this isn't for you chickens i'm sorry unfortunately it's it's not going to work out for you guys, okay? So just please leave me alone and stop pestering me. Okay, but like I say, I'm going to plant the last two down there. And then we're going to wait till they grow and then replant them and expand our wheat farm. But actually, we need to craft ourselves another wooden axe. So let's go ahead and do that then. Just like so. Nice. Nothing better than a fresh axe. Apart from it's only a wooden one. So it's not going to last very long, is it? But um, <laughs> yeah. So today, I'm just going to spend literally all day just, you know, collecting some resources, chopping down some trees, collecting as much wood as I possibly can. And that's about it. There we go. So now all of the wood's chopped down and we've collected some of these eggs that these lovely chickens have, you know, have given us. Let's go ahead and turn all of these into planks like so. And then we should have quite a lot of oak planks in here now, as you guys can see. So that's pretty cool. We've got one, two, three, four. We've got four stacks and 38 pieces. And then we've also got a stack of birch planks here, plus the 36 birch logs as well that we can turn into obviously more planks. So that's fine. We've also got 10 more saplings in here, 16 birch saplings. I just realized we've got seven oak saplings right here as well. So so that brings us to 17 oak saplings. So that's nice. Right then. That's pretty cool. And oh my gosh, these trees are growing so fast. Every time I turn around to go and look in the chest or to craft something, these trees keep growing and growing. And I know obviously that's what happens in Minecraft. But oh my gosh, you know, give me a give me a break at least. Okay, so as you can see, some trees have actually grown around us. Oh, and literally, like I say, two actually grown or one. I actually can't remember. But anyways, some birch trees have grown. Some oak trees have grown. I've planted new oak trees along here as well. Some saplings. So 
hopefully that doesn't take too long to grow and as you can see there's loads of chickens roaming around so we're probably going to build like a bit of a barn for those later on so you know just so I can manage them all in one place because they're you know they're a bit loose at the moment but oh my gosh look at these trees growing but how about though let's check on our wheat so far so okay we've got some wheat coming through so I'm going to take these two up here nice and then with the seeds we're going to plant them back down just like so but all we need is one more piece of wheat and we can go ahead and craft ourselves some bread but that's not our only concern right now our only concern is what's below us and i think the only thing to do from here is really just to like dig down so why don't we dig down right now being very careful let me actually do this by like two by two just in case you know there's any like lava below us anything like that all right drop down oh okay so i can definitely hear lava so i've got to be very careful right now yep like i say but oh my gosh look at this i didn't know we'd get this so early on to be honest but oh some iron nice okay so what i think we're going to do is before we have a look what's in that chest i think we're going to head back up to the top and craft ourselves a quick stone pickaxe so therefore you know it's a bit quicker for us it's more durable put some sticks in here cobblestone along the top and nice and just in case we accidentally encounter any mobs i'm going to quickly craft myself a stone sword so now i've got my stone sword and stone pickaxe i think we're ready to see what the next chunk is and oh my gosh what are you doing down here okay well okay hang on we need to get some seeds because i don't want you lost down there okay come on chicken come up here buddy please don't fall i kind of need you guys please come up here there we go right just over here over here and then now they're gone please don't follow me because i don't want you you know burning in some lava because i need to eat you later on okay well let's head down the spiral staircase then and here we go oh my gosh okay we've got some netherrack nice i mean that can be used i guess how about though we quickly take up some iron that's what i'm saying oh i think it's three four pieces nice oh some iron here as well how many pieces though nice okay so in total we've actually got six pieces pieces of raw iron that's actually really good for us but let's go and check out what is in this chest oh look at this golden nuggets a golden axe nice that'll actually come in useful some gold ingots gold leggings why don't we go and equip these real quick oh and some boots look at this look at us and i've just noticed there's even more iron up here so let's go and carefully oh my gosh oh well we'll look at that in a second but oh my gosh look at the carrots are those potatoes as well nice all right so before we explore that part let's quickly take up this iron oh my gosh we can literally craft like full iron tools right now this is insane 13 pieces of raw iron okay maybe not a full set of iron tools but how about let's take up some more nether rack then oh more iron as well not complaining do you think there might be like some like diamonds down here or is that too early on i don't think you'll find diamonds yet oh more iron though okay, i'm really curious what's down there there's probably like uh villagers down there then so we'll go and explore that in a second let's quickly take all this up Ow, that was very silly of me. I'm gonna take up this though. Some stone bricks. Oh my gosh. You know what? Let's take up this chest as well, actually, so we can bring it back up top with us. Alright, but that looks like it's pretty much it for this chunk. So let's head back up top then and see how much iron we actually managed to gather. But in the meantime, let's grab some cobblestone so therefore we can, you know, stack up on those supplies. Alright, let's go back up top. Okay, it's night time, so we've actually got to be very careful right now. But let's craft ourselves a furnace. And let's just pop this down around about here. Okay, so the only thing we have to smelt the raw iron is some sticks. So honestly, we're gonna have to sacrifice some sticks here and use it as some fuel but hello chickens how are you again did you miss me while i was gone i mean i wasn't too long was i but anyways in the meantime let's try and grab this up and then we can oh hang on a minute i know what i'm going to do all right let's turn these into planks turn these into sticks and then let's quickly go ahead and make ourselves a cobblestone well a stone axe and then with this it'll be a lot more quicker now when we chop our trees down there we go all right so as you can see it's going a lot faster now which is good let's go and take this tree here oh no okay come on there we go drop me some oh look, lovely apples nice Let's chop all these oak logs down. And same again with this other one. Oh, yes. Look at them saplings and sticks. Oh, my gosh. Good stuff. And I've got to be very careful for any phantoms because those guys are really, really annoying, to be honest. And they are actually really dangerous. So I've got to be very careful about those. Got to be on my guard at all times. Take some birch logs here because why not? It's nice to have some contrast in the builds. And then all I've got to do is just chop that last chunk at the top. Wait, can I reach that? Yeah. Okay, nice. And then all it is just this one there. There you go. Now it'll all just fall. Okay, nice. Good stuff. Okay, and like usual, we're going to grab our birch saplings, and then we're going to get placing them originally where they was, and then same with the oak saplings. So let's do the exact same thing. We're just following, like, the patches of dirt, you know where they was placed originally okay okay nice let's take some more out and then with this we can go ahead and craft ourselves more sticks like so and then we'll craft our first iron pickaxe already look at that already on the second chunk we've already managed to get ourselves an iron pick that's like easier than usual hardcore minecraft so that's cool all right cool so let's go ahead and put our stuff that we don't need for now in here take some apples though those can uh, come in handy how's our iron getting on okay it's all done now oh no i knew these guys would come out of nowhere i knew it would happen oh I haven't even got a shield to protect myself. Oh, gosh. Oh. 
Okay, let's quickly make ourselves a shield. Oh, oh my gosh, he's coming in so fast. Let's quickly equip this, like so. Okay, oh my gosh, look, we got a shield now. And he's coming right for us. There we go. Get out of here, Phantom. What are you doing? I knew you'd come out of nowhere. I just knew it was coming. I knew what you're up to. But it's fine. We've got some Phantom membrane. We're going to go ahead and stick this in the chest because we don't want it. Ugh. Oh, look at the wheat that's actually grown. Let's go ahead and take all this up. Nice. Right, let's plant these seeds down like so. And then put the wheat in here. Actually, do you know what? We're going to craft some bread. There you go. Two pieces of bread. Why not? But it looks like the sun's going to rise any minute now. It should, you know, rise up again and be daytime and not so scary up here on our own. Let's make a chess piece, you know, because we've got to be protected out of here what else can we craft well there's actually not a lot to craft but like i say look at the sunrise it's literally about to rise any second now which is cool another new day let's go ahead and put the iron ingots in here for now because we don't really need them and the obsidian but let's take some wood out just in case we need it uh honestly i think we'll just take some cobblestone as well i want to make like a little center thing so there's like holes going all the way down for each and every chunk the bottom all the way to the top that'd be really cool so i might actually do that later on but just for now we're gonna you know make do with what we've got we might have to sacrifice some health right now let's go ahead and build out over here we might take some fall damage but it's fine well we made it to the next chunk oh look at the nice farm here okay i can definitely hear villagers hello villagers like i was saying uh right let's go down here then oh what have you guys got going on right now just minding your own business or what are you uh what are you guys up to right now i will take these carrots though sorry but you know it is what it is but hey look i'll replant some for you how about that just especially for you okay i'll take my profit in carrots and you can take your guys's other carrots i guess let's take those potatoes do the same again okay now i've got a good food source right now actually so that's really good what's going on in here oh okay you got some beds going on here you got a little hut that's that's cool okay i can hear zombies that isn't good um but let's see if we can take some more seeds up with this grass it all helps for the wheat farm doesn't it any seeds knocking about here yeah okay we've got another one here but let's take this wood up though while we can oh and torches where do those torches go okay they're there so we've got five torches so far and then how about we build up to the top real quick we're gonna connect this like that like so and then all we can do now is hop up here and then we've made it to the chunk that we started on and there we go and oh my gosh look at the trees here we've got some work to do what what happened to my chicken what actually happened to him did the tree grow and he just like got slain or something i don't i, I really don't know what happened there but all i know is that i've got some raw chicken now so i suppose that helped with the hunger bars though we could do with uh cooking that chicken real soon and eating it to be honest because our hunger bars are looking kind of low right now honestly our drumsticks are running out with the torches that we got we can start placing them around so like there plant some there what the heck? Oh my gosh, that literally spawned as soon as I was there. Plant one like here, maybe. Why not? So then we haven't got to worry about, you know, any mob spawning in or anything like that. But let's put some raw chicken in here for now. And while that actually cooks, let's eat some of our potatoes that we stole from those villages. I mean, they're our friends anyway, so we're just we're lending the potatoes for now. I want to build a barn for these guys, but I'm not sure where to build one, actually. Oh! Uh, hello, bees! Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Okay, okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. You guys are so scary. Oh, no. Okay, well, we've just been stung by some poison. That's nice, isn't it? Look at us. Okay, no, we're fine now. But like I was saying, let's grab a bucket of water, like so. We can sort of, you know, start building out, extending a bigger farm. We can build a barn for these animals. Okay, so we're going to build, like, a bit of a bridge coming out here, like so. Oh, my gosh, I can see every single chunk. This is kind of spoiling it, but whatever. So we've got a stack of slabs, and now what we can start doing is kind of building outwards, like so. This is where the barn's going. Going to be and then we can build the same sort of thing over here all right let's go and grab this coal then okay we've got 11 pieces of coal from that actually which is pretty cool i can hear lots and lots of mobs underneath us let's go to the next chunk how about that let's just dive straight into the next chunk and see what it's all about because i hear some mobs i want to get involved in some action we're going to bring our water bucket just in case oh i hear lots of mobs there's some copper here oh my god is that some sheep as well Oh, oh, hello, skeletons. Oh, my gosh. Okay, wow. Oh, my gosh. Look how many mobs there are. What? What is this? Right, well, I'm going to mind my own business for now. Okay, I know I'm going to get... Yeah, okay. Oh! Oh, okay. They're fighting each other now. Oh, my gosh. What is going on? What is actually going on right now? Okay, I'm going to take you one by one. I'm going to try... Oh, my gosh. Okay, have we got any torches? Okay, we have. How about we quickly place some torches down? Oh, no. I'm going to get shot, though. Oh, there's a creeper. There's a creeper. No, 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 no. Oh! Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. What just happened? What just happened? We need to eat. We're literally like two and a half hearts. Okay, we're staying here just for now because we need to regain some health badly. Did you see what that creeper done though? That skeleton set him off. That was so close. Okay, that was super close. Come on now. No, skelly, leave me alone. Oh my gosh, why are you so... There you go. <gasps> These skeletons, bro. I need him to come close to me though so I can actually like fight him off. 
Wow, this is insanely risky. What am I doing right now? Okay, okay, this is good. Stay there, stay there, stay there. Yes, zombie attack. Why aren't you attack? Okay, no, there's a creepy there again. There we go. Oh, spider. <gasps> okay, is that it? Is that all the mobs done down here now? I need to plant some torches just in case. Wow, that was actually really risky. I knew I could hear loads of mobs though. And I knew that there was something down here that was really risky. But let me take up this iron. Nice. That will do it. That'll do the trick. Okay, that's cool. We've got some cows here as well that we can maybe take up to the top. Have we got any wheat? Let's take this coal up though. Look how much coal's up here. Wow. Oh, there's a villager up here. What are you doing up here, buddy? Just chilling, roaming around? Well, you want to be careful that you don't fall off of the edge, to be honest. How about then we quickly chop all these trees down and then we can start extending extending our little make do bridge here and we can start building our little barn so let's quickly do that so firstly i grabbed my resources and began the build i then started placing some barrels down for pillars and then used my slabs to extend outwards thereafter i raised the barrel pillar with oak logs and proceeded to do this with all of them After I had the pillars up, it was time to start building the shelf for my roof. This was made out of oak slabs and oak stairs. To give the roof some contrast, I added some birch stairs. I also did this for the other side. Okay, so quick little update. As you can see here, we're making some progress. And I don't know why there's a fisherman there. Probably because of the barrels, but whatever. But I'll walk you guys around. So as you can see, we've got like the little bridge here, so which is cool. And as you come down here, I decided to put some barrels in between the blocks. Just to give it, you know, that barn kind of feel. I filled in the roof with like birch slabs and birch stairs. Just to give it some contrast. I'll go over here so you can see like better. But okay, there you go. So as you can see, the roof's filled in over here. I'm just working on this roof here. So this is where like all the stables are going to be so i can put all the animals in here inside here you know i can put some other stuff some chests you know maybe even put like a little farm out this front here but yeah it looks pretty cool to be honest but i thought i'd keep you guys updated and uh kind of let you know where i'm going with this i raised the pillars here where the barn will be this is where all the animals will be kept just like the main roof i followed the same pattern with oak and birch stairs and slabs after that i filled in the main entrance to my barn and stripped the oak logs I made the frames each side of the barn where I placed oak fences for windows. Then it was time to start filling in the floor with oak slabs. For added detail I put oak trapdoors in the frames as windows for my animals. And for my safety I put some fence gates for the entrances and then started placing normal fences around the barn. After that it was finally time to start making some final touches, which consisted of slabs on top of the barrels, filling the barn floor in with dirt blocks, placing oak fence gates in for pens, adding some detail to the windows, making a sustainable wheat farm. Filling the inside of my barn in with necessities. And eventually it was officially done. Check it out. Alrighty, so as you can see behind me, it is all done. And, uh, well, I say all done, there's still some things to add, but to be honest, we've done most of it. So, as you can see, we made, like, a little bridge here, as you guys knew. And then if we come over here, open these fence gates, like so. We've got a little wheat farm going on here. We've got some two villagers here that are fishermen. I don't know why they're not farmers yet, so I've got to probably sort that out soon. But anyways, as you can see, I give them two little beds here, so, you know, they can 
rest up when they need to. Over here is all the pens. So this is where all like the cows, the pigs, chickens, etc. This is where they're all going to go. I filled the inside with dirt here, you know, to kind of connect to this sort of farm bit because they're obviously animals. But then over here, as I'll actually show you right now, uh, if we head over this way, I also detailed the sides with things such as like birch buttons, which is pretty cool. I also started putting more fences up like here, as you can see, you know, just for some detail, play some torches around here to brighten things up a little bit. Uh, if we come around this way, we got some a lot of storage. So, I mean, we can actually put like lots of things in here, to be honest. It's more of like a house and a barn. I mean, you could literally live in this thing. It's so cool. But anyways, as you can see, some fences up there, uh, fences around here, around the sides, a couple of furnaces, crafting tables, chests, barrels, etc. And then this bit here just leads straight towards the barn. We spaded the dirt, you know, to give it this nice little finish. We left the dirt blocks here because we're probably going to like play some stuff here, you know, just so it looks cool. I left this bit blank as well, you know, because the villagers are living here. And we followed up the pens, you know, with some oak fence gates. Same with the entry here, obviously. And then all around, we just, you know, put some normal oak fences all around. But yeah, honestly, I like it. If we take a stand back here, just two seconds, I think it looks pretty cool. Honestly, I think it actually looks really cool. I'm really pleased with it. It looks nice. Honestly, I really like it. I like the contrast between the, you know, the birch and the oak. It's really nice. So I approve of it. This will, um, this will definitely do for now. So all we got to do now, really, is just bring the animals up here and put them in the pens. But I don't think we have any leashes on us. But anyways, we'll worry about that in a second. But as you can see also, I, you know, took some wheat over from here and put it over there. Because, you know, we don't really need this little thing here now. So what we can actually do is we can get rid of this and sort of flatten it. And then we can start, you know, extending out this way and doing such and such over there. So, yeah, it's pretty cool. I mean, we've got our farm now. So I'm really pleased with that. You know, we got somewhat of a living space. But, yeah, I mean, that's pretty much it for the barn, honestly. Now that we have the barn built and two friendly villagers have joined us and I'm not sure obviously they're fishermen because of the barrels But maybe we can use them later on for some trades. But anyways, oh, yeah, actually I forgot to show you guys while I was doing some stuff I grabbed some wheat and um, I managed to find this guy the sheep's in this pen for now So, you know, I'm maybe going to section some sheep off in here put some chickens in this one There's some cows in this one, but honestly, I kind of like the company of these two villagers They're uh, keeping me nice and social on this lonely one chunk. But anyways, oh actually I thought I had some chickens roaming around I've got any seeds okay where is my wheat seeds where do they all go okay right let me just harvest this for now two seconds let me just grab some wheat seeds for my lovely chicken friends like so oh yeah oh my gosh look how much seeds we got from that look at that nearly like two stacks all right well let's quickly get placing these back down and then once we place these down we can go and explore the next chunk okay nice uh where are the chickens come on chickens come with me come on just through here nice and i'm gonna put you i'm gonna put you in this end one why not okay all right come inside come on there we go our lovely chickens do you know what i'm gonna give you some seeds as well so you give me a little baby chicken Whoops. Yay, look at that. Hello, little baby chicken. How are you doing, buddy? I'm going to give you some seeds. Why not? Well, there we go. We now have three chickens on here, so that's pretty cool. We need to find another sheep for you, so I'm pretty sure there's one down on the chunk where we left off, so let's quickly head down. All right, down here, and then down this one. Oh my gosh, we are really uh, progressing now, aren't we? Okay, right. Whoops. There we go. Okay. Oh, we got some cows here. What if we take all of the cows down here? Right. Oh my gosh, look how many there are. Okay, let's carefully bring all of these cows up. Oh, I didn't mean to to do that that is completely my bad all right come on then up here with cows one by one come on one at a time guys why aren't they coming up okay we'll uh we'll figure something out later right this is gonna be a little bit awkward here isn't it can you guys fit or ah uh, okay i see uh right hang on we're gonna have to sort this out okay are you up uh, okay, can you like jump up or oh, what's going on here? Why can't you get up here? Well, I'm so confused. Why are you guys stuck? Hang on a moment. Ah, oh, okay. There we go. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, right. Come on, cow. Can you get up here? Yeah, yeah, let's go. Oh, they both can. Okay, maybe I was just being silly. All right, come on then. Oh, gosh. Right. <laughs> you guys are too big to fit through here. Right, come on then. Can you guys get up now? No. Okay, right. Let me dig this side as well. Oh my gosh, cows. Come on. What are you guys doing right now? Okay, there we go. Right, come on. What are you guys doing? What is going on? Uh, I mean, can you like. There we go. Okay, okay. All right, nice. Nice, right. Now we go up here, okay? Very carefully, one at a time, please. Because you guys are so eager for this piece of wheat in my hands. Right, this is going to be the difficult part. Can you get up here? Oh, easy peasy. Well, look at that. Okay, then up this part. Where's your other friend? There, okay. All right, so up here then. Up the spiral. I know it's a bit difficult, guys, but come on, you you got this. There we go. Where's your friend at? Is your... Yay! Okay, right. Now, let's bring you guys onto our lovely barn. Oh, wait, where's your friend going? Hello? Where are you going, cow? Okay, through here. Come on now. Don't be silly. Through here. I'm going to close this behind you, and then I'm going to put you into this barn right here. So, just walk in like so. There we go, and then shut these, and then I'll give you guys some wheat so you guys, you know, can maybe have a little baby cow. Oh, 
Aw, hey baby cow. Well, now we have a baby cow. We can just wait for it to grow up, I guess. And how's the chicken getting on? Are you okay, baby chicken? Are you fine down here? Well, it's fine, okay? Right, so we've got some cows in here and sheep. So honestly, it's pretty cool. We might um we might bring some more cows up, honestly. I'm pretty sure there was like a, a few cows down here. So I think we left a few. So let's quickly go down here and bring them up. Right, cows. Hello, what are you doing? Come here, buddy. Right, follow me. And I'll bring you to your new home, okay? Okay, up here. This is the tricky part, I think, isn't it? You guys got this? Oh, you guys are better than the other group of cows. Wow. Okay, right. So up here as well. Up here. Yes. Good cows. And then up this one. Up the little spiral. Okay, you still following me? Right, okay. They're still with me. Wow, it's like I'm taking them through like an obstacle course or something like that. Right, up here then. Yes. Okay, into the barn we go. Oh. I didn't mean to give you that right now. I'm going to put you guys inside of here, and I'm quickly going to shut these behind me, and I'm going to give you guys some wheat so you know you can do your thing. Right, that should do it for now. There we go, another little baby chicken. Right, we're expanding our little animal farm here, actually. We've got lots of cows. We've only got one sheep, though, so let's try and bring another sheep up here. Oh, my hunger bar's looking kind of low. I actually got to eat real quick. Well, I'm going to have literally infinite food sources. I'm going to have, like, a carrot and potato farm. I've got some, you know, some cows, some chickens. There's a pig down here as well. You know what? You can stay down. I was literally seconds away from, you know, slaying you, pig. But you know what? You're you're fine. I'll leave you there. Give me some saplings or something. But I'll take your oak wood regardless. Okay, honestly, not bad. That's uh, that's pretty cool. Let's take some of this, though. You know, decoration. We might need it around the barn or the house. We'll take it up for now. It all helps. It all helps. Right, and if you didn't just have a little sneak peek below us, there is another chunk. And oh my gosh, it's a moose room. Oh, we haven't got enough cobblestone. Let's quickly take some cobblestone from here then. So we can go down to the next chunk. Whoa, little moose room. Awesome iron down here. Wow. I didn't actually expect to find this, but I will take it. I will take it. That fisherman actually give us a trade where I think if you give him like some emeralds, he'd give you some kelp. And also one of them had like a, it was like, I think it was like 20 pieces of string, which is actually quite a lot, but it was like 20 pieces of string for like kelp. So honestly, we could, you know, turn them into some, what just happened? Oh no, did that little, oh, I think that little guy just fell down there. Honestly, hang on a moment. Oh wait, there's water down here anyway, so it's fine. Ooh. Okay. Oh no, a little rabbit. Oh, well. Hello, mushrooms. What are you guys doing up here? Um, I mean, do you know what? I'm actually going to take your sand because I feel like I'm going to have some glass in the, in the new build. So I will take as much sand as I possibly can. Take some more sand. Lovely, lovely. Okay, how many pieces have we got now? 23? Not bad. Oh, no. My shovel broke. Well, that's a shame. Well, let's take the remaining pieces of sand like this. Nice. We've got quite a bit of sand now, honestly. Okay, right. What's the best way to dig to the next chunk? I'd say probably like this way. So, therefore, you know, no water crosses us. And it's a much safer way, honestly. Some coal here. Lovely. Let's quickly, while we can then, let's make some torches. Right. Okay, now we've got some lighting down here, which is much easier to see. Oh, my gosh. Look how much coal is down here. Oh, look at this. Whoa, what is this? Oh my gosh, it's like a snow biome. Okay, right. Okay, there's a tree. Ouch. Oh my gosh, look at this. Right, let's build like a little spiral staircase, like so. Oh my gosh, look how nice the sky looks. Whoa. All right, so now we have our little spiral staircase. It's much easier now to, you know, go up, but we're going to have to try and build one up there later on. But that's fine. Let's not worry about that for now. Let's just quickly go down here. Oh, oh my gosh, I did not mean to do that. Oh, some sugar cane. More sheep as well. Honestly, pretty cool. Oh, we got some spruce logs. Okay, we only got one spruce sapling. Let's actually take all these spruce trees down. Let's take all of this up. Oh. Oh, hello, little guy. You okay? Just roaming around, having some fun. That's so satisfying when all that snow falls. Right, let's see if we can try and reach. Ugh. Okay, there we go. Right, let's just try and build this like so. Right, there we go. Look at this. Okay, now we have a little easy spiral staircase. So we're actually going to make this like a little double just to make it a little bit easier for us. Okay, nice. Okay, that's fine. Now we've got some easy access to the, uh, you know, to go up a chunk. All right, hello, sheep. Oh, I should have crafted some shears, honestly. I actually need you guys. I actually do need you guys. Okay, follow me, sheep. You're coming on a mission with me. Oh, no, you in the water. Can you come out? Okay, there we go. Right, so I'm going to take these sheep from down here all the way back up to the top. Ah, you're pushing me off. Stop it. Okay, right, let's go up slowly together. Okay, come on, guys, just one at a time, you know? We, we can do this. Okay, up here, can you make it? Oh, no, that sheep fell. Oh, gosh. Come up, sheep. Yeah, yeah, you got it. You got it. Okay, as long as you're on this chunk, I can go and get the other sheep, okay? All right, so now if I quickly switch out the wheat, go back down real quick. Come on. There you are. Come on, sheep. Ouch. I've got to stop taking unnecessary fall damage. Oh, there's a lantern there. I just realized we can actually use that. Okay, right. Come on. Right. So let's go back down here then. We're going to take this lantern because I really want it. Let's make a little crafting table. A little make do one. Let's pop it right there. Let's put our sticks in here and then make a little axe. And we're going to dig down to the next chunk. I think we should dig around about here, honestly. I wonder what the next chunk is though. I'm actually kind of scared. I don't know why, but I am. <laughs> don't ask. Okay. All right. What is it? Come on. What have you got for us? What is this? Oh, is this like a jungle? Oh, no. I'm actually not putting up with the stone pickaxe, so I'm going to go back up to the top really quick 
and craft ourselves an iron pickaxe. All right, and finally we made it to the top. And so we're gonna grab our 15 pieces of raw iron. Let's put some oak planks in here. You know, we don't really need it, right? And then once we've crafted ourselves an iron pickaxe, we can go and explore that next chunk. I think it was actually like a jungle biome or something like that. That's what it looked like, but I'm not sure. We're about to find out anyways. I actually really like this barn a lot. It looks so cool. Let's make a little helmet while we can as well, actually, because I haven't got one yet. And do you know what? I'm, I'm gonna keep one. Do you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna make some lanterns. Because now I've seen that, I really want like loads more. Let's put one there and one there. We're, okay, we're actually going to like scatter these like everywhere. I love lanterns so much. Best thing ever added to Minecraft. Honestly, love them. Let's take some coal. Let's craft some more torches. Okay, I know what I'm going to do. I'm gonna place one there. I'm going to place one there, and I'm also going to place one right there, okay? So let's see how that looks. Oh, it makes it look so much better. Anywhere else we can just quickly, like, plant this? I mean, we could plant one, like, there. I mean, that's cool, right? Well, I'm going to leave that one there anyways, and then I'm going to put one there, I think. But, yeah. Anyways, let's go out of here for now. Okay, right, now we've got a little helmet, and, you know, we've got an iron pickaxe, a fresh one as well. Let's quickly go back down then, and let's give these sheep a new home. Come on, come to your new home. Oh, and mushrooms as well, actually. Wait, where did the other mushroom go? Did it fall down here? Ah, I knew you'd get stuck. Okay. Okay, come on then. Come on, Mushroom. Yay. All right. We've got to be very careful here, actually, because there's lots of uh, there's lots of animals that's going to follow me up here. And, you know, it's not that big. Honestly, I might just have to extend it two by two like we did last time to make it a little bit easier for those guys. Right. Come on then. Let's go. I think I've got to go, like, kind of slow for these because as there is a lot, I don't want to leave anyone behind. I'm not sure if you guys are all going to fit up here, honestly. Okay. Oh, no. Okay, let's take, let's take them all up to this chunk. Come on. Can you get up here? Guys, come on. There we go. Right. And let's get them up to this chunk up here. Why do they keep getting stuck? Oh my gosh, come on. Oh no. I'll, I'll take your mutton though. Oh my gosh, right, come on. Okay, I just heard someone fall. Who was that? So if I can just get them, you know, just to stay here for now. And then I can quickly take that out, right? And I can go back down here and then take these two up with me. Okay, are you ready, guys? All right, come on then. Oh no. Guys, come on. Wait, have we got all of you? Okay, yes, we've got all of you up here. I'm not too bothered about the mushrooms. I just really want the sheep up here. I'm going to put the mushrooms in with just the normal cows. Come on. No, yes, yes. Oh, get in there, get in there, get in there. Okay, that was actually pretty good by me. Okay, right, now in you come. Your other friends, nice. Shut that up. Let's quickly give you guys some wheat. And we got ourselves a little, well, two baby sheep with the rest of the iron. We should have made ourselves a pair of shears, but it's whatever. Breed some more cows, why not? Let's grab some seeds for the chicken as well. Okay, we're actually multitasking like heavily right now. I like this. Go back through here and then, oh, look at the little baby cows. Right, let's give you guys some seeds. Okay, so I crafted us some bowls and with these bowls we can take some of this to make some mushroom stew. We'll leave these roaming around here for now, but we do need a bed. Oh, we need some iron. Okay, right, let's go and find some iron. And while we're down here as well because there was some carrots and, was it potatoes? Yeah, let's go and take all of this up. Oh, you want this carrot? I'll give you the carrot. Why not? Ooh, we got a poisonous potato. We don't want that. Oh, yeah, okay. This is a jungle biome. Let's quickly build down. Oh, there we go. This is literally just what we needed, actually. Now we can finally make ourselves some shears. Well, wow, there's lots of bamboo here. Okay, I have an idea. I have an idea. Right, so let's mine all this stone here because it's in the way. Oh, nice. Some coal. Right, let's go and take this coal up, though, actually, while we can. It looks like it's another new day. I can't really tell, but I think the sun's coming up a little bit, so that's cool and oh my gosh look at this oh look at all this cocoa beans lots of cocoa beans here hello panda how you doing buddy look at the iron up there okay we've got lots of bamboo though and let's quickly chop all this down get some jungle logs panda don't mind me buddy just minding my own business chopping your lovely trees down <laughs> you enjoying that buddy you enjoying that bamboo oh you're, you're really enjoying that aren't you here we go i'll give you some of that you like that oh there's another panda here i'll give you some as well because i don't want you feeling left out you know there was some iron back up there was oh there's some iron there as we talk as well wow oh my gosh that was close hello Chris. Creepers. That was a close call. If I would have fell down there, it would have been game over for me. Oh, and a skeleton. Oh, I hate you, skeleton. All right. Oh, my gosh. I don't want to have an arrow to the foot. It's just this skeleton that I'm worried about. I'm not even worried about the creepers at this point, even though there are actually quite a lot of creepers. Wow. Okay, you're one hit now, surely. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, my gosh. No, 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 no. Okay, well. Oh. We're going to keep running around here. Okay, surely you're... What? Oh my gosh. We're half a heart. What just happened? Oh my gosh. That was so close. Wow. I did not expect that. I thought that creeper was a lot lower than what it appeared to be. 
Whoa, look at the emeralds. Well, we can actually have some... We got a first diamond. Okay, we got some enchantments. What else have we got down here? More diamonds. Okay, right. We've got to be careful. And that would be because there's lots of TNT. Let's quickly make another chest. Put all the junk in here. Well, I say junk. We're going to need this stuff. Right, let's take some carrots, potatoes, some sticks. Honestly, I think that's it. That is it, right? All right, not to worry. Oh, look how nice the lanterns look now. Oh my gosh, it looks so cool. Have we got anything to smell? Or can't I just see that? I'm not sure. But anyways, let's go back down. Yeah, let's, let's head back down. Hope no mobs spawn in while I'm down. I don't want to get involved in any uh, serious fights right now. Down here, down the spiral. That reminds me, I have to light this part up because I don't want any mobs spawning down here. So I'm just going to quickly place my torches. Wait, where's the next chunk? Is it down here? Wait, where is it? Ah, oh, wait, okay, it's here. All right, let's put that there to make ourselves not forget. Okay, right. Let's mine this iron then before we forget about it. Was that all the iron? Pretty sure there was a lot more than that. Or am I just like being silly right now? Okay, now we can take some good stuff up. Oh my gosh, look at this. Right, feather falling three. More sand. We'll take some string because we definitely need that and the sand. Uh, Diamonds. Yep, yeah, we'll definitely take the diamonds. Wow. I didn't expect the first diamond to be found in a chest, but whatever. Uh, what's in this chest? Oh, lovely emeralds. Oh my gosh, look at this stuff. Golden apple. Protection three. Wow, some actually good enchants as well, to be honest. Nice, more emeralds. What's that? Protection three as well. More string, more sand. I'll take these bones as well, actually. I'll take these. Another diamond. So we've got two diamonds now. We can actually, if we wanted to, officially craft ourselves a diamond sword but we won't we won't yet we won't yet another enchantment there some more string diamond horse hammer i mean we don't really need that but uh, you know i mean it's whatever right Take that string i was gonna say we could have uh, crafted ourselves a shovel and took all this sand up but i mean hey if we need sand we can always do that right it gives us something to do let's mine down here though i don't know what the next chunk is actually going to be this is really scary because i mean you just don't know what's next okay what is that oh okay i see a frog but what <laughs> whatever i'm gonna take this lantern again because i love my lanterns okay so don't worry about that. Did I take all the good stuff just to make sure? I did, didn't I? Apart from the diamond horse armor. But I mean, I don't need that yet, so that's fine. Okay, this is where it's going to get a little bit more scary because I see a skeleton and I do not like skeletons, if you can tell already. More iron. Nice. Let's take this up. Let's light this place up a little bit, actually, because it's really dark down here. Okay, let's go. Oh, okay. Loads of creepers. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Place some torches around while I can, though. Stay back. Stay back. Oh my. Well, that kind of helped me in a way, actually, because it eliminated the other... Uh... Oh, wait, the mobs on my side right now? Like, what is going on? They're literally all eliminating each other, but hello, little zombie. I'm sorry, bro, but you're gonna have to get out of here, okay? I'm still yet to find some kelp. I need it for fuel. Okay, let's put that coal in it for now, and then smelt some iron. Then we can go and craft ourselves an iron pick. What are you doing, frog? This iron isn't for you, buddy. It's for me. Get out of here. Oh. I didn't expect that. I'm sorry. Well, that was unnecessary. There we go. Lovely fresh iron pick. These mangrove roots, honestly, I hate them. Listen to the sound of them. Oh, they're just horrible. I don't like it. Oh, I see two little friends down there. Allies, is it? I don't know how you pronounce it. I'm sorry. Do I hear an Enderman? There's an Enderman down here. We know what happened last time when there's skeletons and creepers around. But while I'm up here, I might as well grab this coal. I mean, you know, it's just sitting here looking at me. So I might as well just do something useful with it. There's two piggies here. Oh, okay, okay. I'm sure we can work something out here. Okay, nice. Oh, no. Can I have that? Can I have that back? Thank you. Actually, let's get rid of this Enderman. Hopefully, he drops us some Ender Pearls. What are you going to do, buddy? I'm looking you in the eye. What are you going to do? There we go. Please. Ender pearls? No. Are you telling me they didn't even drop any ender pearls? Really? I need to take that back off of you. Stop. I mean, I got a little advancement for that. You can never go wrong with dark oak logs. Let's actually give this little guy a dark oak log. If he stops running away from me. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Thank you, buddy. What don't we need? We don't really need a chain, do we? And we made it back up to the top. Wow, look at that. What have we got? What have we got? We got more lanterns. Well, one more. Ah, yes, that was it. We was going to put the lantern over here, wasn't we? Like that. There we go. That's pretty cool. Oh, that's right. We need to make some shears, don't we? Okay, let's go up here. There we go. And now we can start clipping some wool off you guys and we can craft ourselves a bed. Ugh. Ah, oh, that's right, my inventory's full. There's so much to do right now. Oh my gosh, I don't even know where to start. So we've got a wall here, and we have wood. So let's make a bed. Okay, now we have our own bed, so we can literally place this here, and we can go to sleep. There we go. We had a nice night's rest, and oh my gosh, you are shining, Mushroom. That's sunlight behind you. But yeah, here we go. Another day. We have our bed down now, which is pretty cool. When we build a house here, you know, we can go ahead and put that inside, but that's there for now. Okay, so let's take our pickaxe out. Let's take our shears. Now we have full iron tools. It will now be a a lot easier for us to do things around here. Let's also take some wheat up while we can. Collect those seeds and wheat, like so. Nice. Oh, sorry. Hang on a moment. We didn't even place the seeds back. What am I thinking? Okay, let's quickly place these down. 
But now that we've placed the wheat back down, the seeds, we can hope for that to grow soon. And then check back on our iron. Nice. Let's go ahead and organize the chests, actually, in the barn. So let's take all of our wheat, you know, all of our crops, basically, you know, our carrots and you know, sugar cane. There we go. Now we've got some sugar cane growing. We're progressing in here. Let's go and put all of our seeds in here. Right. And then let's put bamboo in here. Let's go and take all of our food out. Okay, I'm pretty sure that's all the food we got. Honestly, I might have to recheck that in a second, though. But anyways, all of our food in this chest here. That's not really food, but we'll leave it in there. We can also do some baked potatoes as well. Now we can go and put our wooden stuff in our wooden chest. Just so we're all organized, you know. We need to put our wheat in this chest. There we go. Seeds and wheat in this chest. Got our wood in this one. Some bamboo in here and some food in this one. Okay, and so on. You know, we can put lots of stuff in all of these chests, actually. There we go, cows. Enjoy your wheat while you can. Okay, we got five pieces of raw beef, actually. That was pretty decent. So, yeah, now that we're all organized and we've got our two fishermen beside us. Oh, and our little friends here. You still got that raw piece of iron in your hand. That's fine. I'll let you play with that for now. Hopefully, we're going to, you know, let these cows grow up. And then we can start feeding them wheat again to give us some more cows. Look at the sugar cane here as well. Let's go and harvest this real quick. Place them down so we can grow some more. And then we'll put this sugar cane in this little farm chest over here. But while I've got, you know, the most important things done, there's only one really major thing that we got left to do. And obviously, apart from from, you know, build a house and build some other, you know, cool builds and everything. As you can see, our spiral staircase isn't the best. It's really bad, as you can see. Look at that. So I think what we're going to do is it will take some time, but you know, I have to get to work. So I think I'm going to clear this whole chunk and, you know, really go like through one by one and just, you know, make a nice staircase. I think that's what I'm going to do, actually. Let's quickly do that then. So the staircase is going to start about here. We might need to craft ourselves a shovel real quick. We're going to get rid of all these dirt blocks. But yeah, we're pretty much just going to, you know, clear this whole chunk so, you know, it's nice and open. We've got lots of space. Oh, nice, some coal. I will definitely take this. Well, I mean, at least we're going to have lots and lots of cobblestone, right? Well, as you can probably tell, I've made quite a lot of progress, honestly. We've actually managed to clear out quite a lot of areas. What we've got to do now, really, is, you know, build like a cool staircase sort of leading from down there and then upwards. So basically, I decided instead of, you know, having the staircase going this side, I thought it'd be a better idea to, you know, start it off this side, saying as, you know, it might have a better connection to the platform down here. Pretty much what I'm going to do is I'm going to put my spruce logs in with my coal and I should get some charcoal. I should have done this ages ago, honestly. I know it's not the most efficient way, but, you know, it's going to have to work for now. But while that does its thing in there, I am going to get cracking with this staircase. I'm going to place my stone bricks like so. And same for this side. Okay, there we go. So basically, I'm going to have my staircase going down here. So shout out to Legion V. But I'm going to make it stone brick each side here and contrast it with some oak planks and stone bricks. Craft some oak stairs. One there, and one there, and I'm going to do this so on, all the way down to the bottom. And in the middle, I'm going to do some stone brick stairs, but I'm going to craft myself real quick, actually, before I forget. I'm going to smelt this into stone, so I can go ahead and, you know, craft myself a stone cutter. Move shrooms, what are you doing? Okay, now we should have enough, right? So it's... Is it like this? Yeah, okay, there we go. So, right, now we have a stone cutter. Let's go ahead and... Hmm, where should we put this? Let's just put it here for now. But basically, what I'm trying to say is when we eventually have enough, it's we can literally craft, like, some of this. As you can see, so literally three stone is three stone bricks. So it's a more efficient way than, you know, rather crafting lots of stone bricks. But yeah, so that's what we're going to pretty much do all the way down. So you guys pretty much get the idea, right? I like it. The nice bit of contrast in it and you know it's, it's actually really nice let's go and check on our stone see if we have any more perfect i might make a separate platform for my tree farm because therefore i can grow some more oak logs actually because i need i need a lot more oak planks than i thought i'm going to take some full damage but it's fine Oh gosh, that really scared me. Ouch. So what we can do is we can start like doing this. There we go. See, look, it joins this platform perfectly. See where I'm going with this now? Placing these lovely oak stairs. Whoops. There we go. And then same with the stone brick stairs. Oh gosh, no, I keep accidentally misplacing this stuff. There we go. Okay, that's pretty cool. And then we can do one more, right? Let me get rid of these blocks actually because they're quite dangerous to have around here. Why would I just want to leave all this around here, right? It's too dangerous. So now I'm going to plant that there, place that there, and then this. Oh no, I need more stone bricks actually. Hopefully I've got more stone now then. Yes, okay. All i got to do is put some of that in there. There we go. Now we've got eight pieces. Cool. And now what we can do is we can place the remaining pieces just this side. I only needed two pieces, but I'm going to need more anyways. Thought I'd craft more than not enough. Okay, what is going on here? There we go. I right, know we can get rid of this dirt. Nice. So, now this leads to an actual platform. We can go and grab some cobblestone here and, you know, open it up a little bit here so it's more safe for us. Okay. Hello, Lapis. Can I get you? 
Okay, I did actually. Well, now it's all safe for us. And then what we can do is place some torches here, light it up a little bit, make it nice. This is actually really good looking. I'm really happy with this. Yeah, I'm actually going to get rid of this dirt here because it's quite annoying. Maybe I have to get rid of this too. Being very careful that I don't accidentally fall off. But I thought this looks a lot better than, you know, just a dirt staircase. It's a major upgrade, to be honest. And it's really easy now that we can, you know, get up and down. But we're basically going to do this like the full way down, really. Okay, so honestly, it actually looks pretty good now. We followed that up with some stone brick walls on uh, each side here. And as you can see, we walk down. You know, we keep the same pattern with the wood, the stone bricks, the wood, and so on. Then we went down here. We had to do like a little curve here because uh, obviously we couldn't go straight down. So we had to make a little curve here. And we actually got to get rid of this little hut here, which we are going to do. I might just do it all on the side like I'm doing here. It's going to be like a big spiral leading down to the very last chunk. So let's quickly get rid of this hut then. And then afterwards, we're going to make a little tree farm as well, I think. But let's quickly get rid of all of this wood. Free wood for us, I guess. Okay, so let's go and collect all of our supplies. There's some glass panes here as well. And let's take some of this terracotta up. Almost done. And then all we got to do is just break the floor. There we go. And then follow it up by that. And then same with this side. Okay, well, let's head back up top then and make ourselves another iron pickaxe. And then we can carry on with the stairs. Now that's done. We need some more stone brick walls, actually. We have to always break five blocks wide. So we managed to get ourselves 44 oak stairs. Okay, so I accidentally placed those stairs wrong. So I'm pretty sure it's like this. Sorry, Oak Tree, I'm going to have to get rid of you, unfortunately. Well, it's very blank down here, isn't it? So after literally grinding out the staircase, running back and forth, back and forth, we finally actually made some, like, pretty big changes, honestly. I'll quickly show you around from, you know, the top and then work my way down all to the bottom. Yeah, so this is pretty much the staircase here. And as you can see, it goes down quite a while down there. Obviously, you know, it's made out of some oak planks, stone brick, and some stone brick walls coming all the way down. So on each corner here, as you can see, it's like a little uh, stone brick wall, which is nice. Nice. Makes it look even better. And let's eat some carrots before we starve. It pretty much leads from the top all the way down to the bottom here. Well, I haven't done all the way down yet, but I'm just working my way here. As you can see, I actually need to mine this. Let me just get rid of this. And also the stone can go as well, because that's kind of blocking the whole curve on the stairs. I'm just going to repeat this throughout the whole entire one chunk. It's just easy access to get up to the top, really. It's better than this complete disaster anyways. I mean, look at that. A matter of fact, I'm actually going to get rid of this, because this is just absolutely terrible and oh my sugar cane's grown i'll go and harvest that in a second what are you doing down there mushroom come up come on don't be silly see oh my god why does this keep happening? Well, I'm going to collect your beef anyways. And we're going to let you cook in the furnace for now. We're going to make a little bridge like this leading out like we've done for the barn. But we're actually going to make it so it leads out to a tree farm. So let's go and do that. Quickly before we forget, let's take our sugar cane down. Let's go and deposit this in the chest. Okay. And then let's come back out again and start all over. Okay, now I'm thinking, you know, we've done the staircase all nice and good. It does look nice. But on that note, though, I think we've got lots of oak saplings and such. So I think it'd be wise to make a bit of a tree farm. So I think that's what I'm going to do actually. Okay, right. So it's going to start about here. Okay. And what I can do is I can start placing the dirt back here. Let me take this crafting table up real quick and place it roughly about here. Oh gosh, I nearly fell down there. That would have been very silly of me. Let me craft some wooden planks. Oh gosh, no, 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 no. We don't want this on our chunk, do we? Oh, I need to take some wheat up from here as well, actually. Let me go ahead and do that. Only to the ones that have obviously fully grown because some of them haven't yet, which is completely fine because they'll be harvest later on. Oh my gosh, I need to start getting back on topic. I keep getting way too distracted, guys. Fresh iron shovel and let's get back digging so if we just do our best and clear the rest of this then we got like a flat land at the top and then we can also you know build a house on here later on okay that's right about good i'm gonna have to cover this sorry but i'm gonna have to cover you water we'll make a farm anyways you know with some sugar cane and maybe even a bigger like carrot and potato farm but first of all i want to make myself a tree farm because i don't want to really keep placing the trees and you know on our main chunk because i feel like that's just you know defeating the object you gotta have like certain things for certain stuff you know okay there we go look Look at that. So much better. Apart from the floating chess, furnace, and <laughs> stone cutters, but it's becoming nighttime again. I'm going to get myself to sleep. There we go. That's a lot better. Now we've finished having sleepy time, we can start focusing on what we're actually going to build. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Now we know it's actually even. We can start extending outwards. That's four and eight. Well done, Scoops. You can officially count. Nice. Let's place some torches on here just for now, because later on, you know, we're going to put some lanterns on here instead of torches, make it even 
even better. Then some fence gates, right? So three fence gates just there. There we go. And then all we got to do is just make a little platform. Then we can start placing our trees on it. And because we added another layer to our one chunk, it should have been 16 by 16, right? But now it's basically 17. So 14, 15, 16, and 17. Oh no, we're just short of some dirt. We might actually have some left over in the chest, actually. Or if not, we're just going to have to, you know, farm some ourselves. I don't need that much more, to be honest. It's only just to cover that little area over there. 36. Do you think that would be enough? I think that would be enough, right? And if you guys are enjoying this video so far, don't forget to subscribe and also drop a thumbs up. And make sure you comment down below. Let me know if you enjoy this video or, you know, just what you guys are up to. Oh no. Okay, I'm going to go back down and collect some more dirt. I'm too lazy to do anything like this. I'm being tested and I don't like it. I always end up, you know, being a little bit short, but that is much better. That is much better. Okay, now we've got a nice bit of lighting here, you know, some sun and gleaming on this lovely dirt block. Let's go and fill the rest of the gaps in and we have officially made our tree farm. All we got to do now is just place a bunch of trees, right? So let's grab our oak saplings. Let's plant them round about here and we've also got like loads of different variants of saplings so we can start growing those as well we've got some spruce saplings we've got dark oak but we i think we need two more of those to grow so we'll leave that for now we've got some jungle saplings so we want different variants of wood and we don't want to keep you know going down and back up the top oh my gosh the tree's already grown oh twos grow oh my gosh spruce saplings let's go ahead and plant these this side and let's place our jungle saplings where should we place these oh my gosh okay Everything's growing now, isn't it? I think I'm only going to place like two parts for the birch saplings only because like I doubt I'll be needing much. I mean, yeah, okay, I've done it over there, but place these right here, why not? Let me go and grab my baked potatoes. They should be all done. Ooh, lovely, lovely stuff. Let's go and chop some of these trees down. Maybe I'll have to get rid of that because that's right in the middle of the entrance, but whatever. Look though, I mean, look how cool it looks. It's starting to look pretty cool now, especially when we build a house on here and... I bet we've got so much wood right now. Oh my gosh, look at that. That is a lot of loot. Oh, oh, that was very satisfying if I do say so myself. Okay, we've got lots of wood now. I am not complaining. Let's just chop it all down then, why not? Oh yeah, this literally just soars for our axe. Like, look at the damage it's taking. But do you know what? It's so worth it. I'm gonna make like a wooden chest, just one for now. I'm gonna put that there, right? So we can literally just go ahead and plant all of the wood that we've got. Okay, so we can sort of see where we're at. So let's just take the saplings out for now. I'm actually gonna just go grab all of the wood inside of here. Yeah, see like, there you go. I think we should place some fences around here though. Honestly, I actually think it looks better with fences. So I'm just gonna leave the fences. Right, there we go, 42 fences. That should be enough. There we go. Okay, right, that looks a lot better. I think. Wow, that is growing fast. Oh my gosh. We're actually getting like so much wood right now. We haven't got to worry about even sourcing any wood. But now we have a sustainable tree farm. The next thing to build really is our food farm. And I'm not sure what's gonna be here. What should we uh what should we put here, guys? I'm not I'm not sure. We might even make it like a little enchantment room or we'll figure that out later, okay? Some of that mutton. And then after that mutton's cooked, I'm gonna go and you know make some baked potatoes. So just one more piece. There we go. Alright, now there we go. Okay. What else do we need to cook? Cook. Is that it? You know, our food stacking up. That reminds me, I need to feed some of my animals. There you go, cows. Enjoy. Okay, right, chickens. Sheep, I'll give you some of those. And you can give me some more baby sheep. And then I can put this back in the chest. Okay, there you go. And then I'm just going to take some of this wheat up and get placing back down. Awesome stuff. I have some bad OCD with organization. I've got to literally have it like this. It's so silly, I know. But how's our charcoal getting on? Put some more in there. Why not? And it is now sleepy time. Oh my gosh. Oh no, I didn't place any. Ah, I needed to place torches. That is really silly of me. Why didn't I even think about that? I hear another zombie, I think. Think. As long as there's no creepers and I really don't care. I need more torches, but honestly, I'm just going to cover, like, these areas for now. Okay, that should be enough torches, right? That should definitely do the job. That looks about good now. I think we should start exploring more chunks. What do you guys think? I can't even remember, like, what chunk we even left off at, but whatever. we also got to finish this staircase soon as well, because I think we only got down to here, right? Yeah, so we only got down to here for now, but, I mean, we can always do that, right? So we got a little make-do staircase, so it's fine. We'll just have to use this for now. With this bit of land, actually, I, I think I'm going to just flatten it out a little bit, you know, to make sure it's all nice and easy for us to maintain hello pandas how are you guys doing this is nice and flat now so we can actually see like what we're doing and let's go down to the next chunk go in the water oh there we go oh hello pig yeah this is where we left off wasn't it oh hello horsies fancy seeing you guys here I've got some diamond horse armor, so actually I could bring you guys up to the top with me and, you know, keep you guys as pets. Okay, and it looks like it's going to get very dark on here, so I'm going to... Ooh, nice. There's lots of iron up here. Oh, 
Okay. Well, I suppose that's an easier way for us to get up the top. Hopefully that doesn't happen here as well. It probably will, won't it? Yep. Take some of this coal while I'm here. Perfect. We can actually smelt some iron here. Maybe it was a good idea that I placed this crafting table and furnace here. Let's make ourselves a fresh... Why are you pushing me, piggy? Fresh iron pick. There we go. Just wait for these last three raw pieces to smelt. Oh my gosh, look at this little frog here. What is he doing? Bro looks so suspicious right now. All right, the last piece. Now I've got my tools. Oh, here we go. Oh my gosh, that was a lot. Okay, guys, I want you to guess what's the next chunk. And no cheating, no skipping. I want you guys to comment down below what you think the next chunk is going to be. Because I'm actually not sure, but this might be a bit of a hint with these blocks. Oh gosh. Oh! Whoa, where did you come from? Oh my gosh. Gosh, get out of town, Buster Brown. Might take some of this up, actually. Could be a good building block. Okay, we'll take a stack of that. Start digging down here, though. I hear lots of mobs, so I'm starting to feel like this is going to be a big cave down here. We're about to find out what it is. Wait, is this a spawner? Oh, we got ourselves a spawner. Oh, my gosh. Okay, well, we got ourselves a spawner, guys. I'm going to take all this coal up, though, because there's lots of coal down here. As soon as I saw the cobblestone, I was like, right, okay. I will slay you, though, and take all of your XP. Oh, there's lots of bread. I've got a lead. That's what I need. Yes. Okay, let's open this up a little bit so, we, you know, we got a little uh, XP farm going on here. At least we know this is here, right? So we can always come back down and sort this out. Okay, I'm going to place torchlight about there. Are you guys still going to spawn? Let me test that theory. Yeah, okay. Might be a bit dark down here because there is a spawner and I don't want to make it too bright. So, you know, no zombie spawn or anything like that. Head up the stairs. And it looks like it's a new day. Is it morning now? Is it... I, I don't even know anymore. I've been down there for so long that I, I can't even remember, okay? Well, our trees have definitely grown. Okay, so we got a saddle and a lead now. So we can actually take them horses up here. We've got some dark oak. What else have we got? Let's go and take some of this up then. Oh my gosh, that grew really quick. <laughs> Oh my, oh my gosh. Okay. Well, that really did get for our axe, didn't it? <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, right. Let me go and make myself another axe. We should just make stone ones, honestly, so we can just keep going through them. Well, it's safe to say we have a nice income of wood right now. Oh, and it looks like our wheat is uh, ready to be taken up. Let's just take this up. Oh my gosh, look how many cows there are. Wow. I'm going to start slaying these cows. There we go. Oh, not so fast, buddy. <laughs> You're stuck, aren't you? No, 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 no. Go in there, go in there. There you go, sheep. Chickens, you can have some more seeds and we can go and put this back in the farmer's chest if you will okay we are getting on now aren't we we're getting on our beautiful trees have suddenly grown now as well i can't wait to build a house i'm not quite sure how it's going to turn out or what i'm going to do but i already know it's going to be a pretty cool build it's going to be nice probably going to go to sleep now as well actually and i'm going to go to sleepy time now and it's another beautiful day i fell down the stairs okay well let me walk out from the stairs and uh, anyways as you can see there's obviously still some floating chests there's still a furnace here smelting stone i'm pretty Pretty sure yeah so let me go ahead and collect that we can get rid of this crafting table for now because you know it's quite an easy block just to you know get rid of and place back so anyway let's just place that back there for now but um oh my gosh look at our trees our trees really have grown haven't they so how about we start with the oak real quick right getting rid of the oak fast so what i'm going to do is i'm just going to go in line and then just go straight down, chopping every oak tree down. And then I'm going to come back. And then I'm going to do the same with the birch trees. And then work my way straight over to the other side. As you can see, this is ripping through my axe. Okay, clearly, I need to go and make myself another axe. Unless I have one. Oh, no, I have one. I'm wrong. I do have one. So let me quickly use this. But this just rips for your axe. I mean, it's such a nice mod. It's cool. It's really easy to use. It just absolutely rips for your axes, though. So be careful if you are using the fallen tree mod. Do recommend it, though. Hopefully, this axe gets us through the end. I do doubt it will to be honest because when i chop this tree down i know it's already gonna just completely break on the first hit but let me go and collect these sticks and saplings moving on to the spruce logs let's get rid of this yeah i knew that was gonna happen now it's definitely time to make ourselves a couple of more stone axes we can only make two okay it's fine we'll probably only need two anyways so it's all good i've just got to be careful oh no and i realize if you crouch and break a block like this it won't actually make it fall but when you stand up and break it it then all drops. So that's what I was doing wrong the first time. I just kept on crouching for some reason. I had like this weird habit of just staying crouched whilst I chopped down the trees. But now I sort of, uh, I'm adapting to not do that anymore now. So I'm just going to break it normally. It saves so much time. I've been using the mod wrong the whole entire time and I didn't even notice. That's just how much of a noob I really am. <laughs> but last few down here. There we go. All right, it's all going to drop down. And then I'm. this is going to just rip through my axe. Okay, I could have guessed that to be honest. There we go. Oh, yeah. Let me just collect all of this. Spruce. Lovely, lovely. Yeah. Oh, what's this one log doing here? Just stood up. Get out. Right, we did get 
lots of spruce saplings though. I'm going to quickly place these down. Do you know what? I'm going to place them down in fours, I think. Like this. What do you think? Um, that does mean I have to get rid of it. Okay, well that grew very fast. Oh my gosh, okay. What can I say? Right, okay, well I'm gonna have to chop this one down, aren't I? Ah, uh, saying the tree is too big? Well, that kind of makes sense to... Okay, never mind. Whoa, that is a lot of wood. Wow, that is a lot of wood. We need to go and dispose some of this into the chest. <laughs> wow, that is so much. I'm going to keep the saplings for now in my inventory just so I can sort of manage it and place them back when I need to. I need to make myself more cobblestone. Have I got... Yeah, okay. okay I need to make myself a few more axes, I think. I think four will be fine. There we go. Okay, just so we have enough to get through all of this. Wow, did you actually see that, though? Okay, we're going to do the same for this tree as well. This is what I'm talking about. Look how much time it saves, though, you know? Whoa! <laughs> that is so satisfying. Literally one hit and it does that. Wow. All right. In the meantime, I'm going to place some more oak saplings down. Don't worry, I'm not forgetting about my beloved oak saplings. Don't worry about that. And, of course, where's my birch saplings? There they are. I'm going to also place some birch saplings down, okay? Like I say, I don't need a lot of birch saplings just because I'm not going to use a lot of birch wood, but it's always nice to have down. And before I even know it, there's another tree that's literally grown. Well, hopefully, we're going to go to sleepy time now, but by the time we wake up, it should be, I don't know, maybe there's going to be some more that grows, okay? And to my surprise, there actually is. It's all growing now. Hopefully, we get another one of these grow. Oh, like I say, I'm going to let every single one of these grow uh, before I harvest it, I think. Well, Oh, literally they're just appearing so i'm gonna leave that there for now and then i've got to build a house here though haven't i so what i'm gonna do is in this center bit here this is sort of going to be inside of the build or to be fair i suppose we could just make a house sort of in this barn really you know if we go inside here we can i don't know maybe we can dig down make a separate room like a bedroom maybe i think that'd be the most efficient way right now whoa okay that is a complete jungle over there let's go and check this out real quick <laughs> oh my gosh they're all growing now Look at this. Anyways, I'm going to let the trees do their thing for now. But yeah, like I said, I think the most sensiblest way would be actually, you know, to build a bedroom inside of the barn instead of just build a house here. Because when you think about it, where am I actually putting it? So yeah, maybe I'm just going to get rid of these chests here and sort of organize them, put them somewhere else. Maybe, you know, one there, one there. We'll sort that out. But the most important thing is that we need to get through these chunks, really. So we've got some food. We've got everything we really need. So why don't we go down to where we last left off and then take it from there? See what else we got going on. Okay, so this is where I finished with a staircase, wasn't it? So let me drop into this water. Oh, there we go. And then I'm going to go down again. I'm going to go down to the very bottom where we last, last left off. I think it was the uh, zombie XP farm, wasn't it? Hey, pandas, how you doing? Just chilling, pandas. Imagine if you can put a saddle on these guys and actually, like, have them as pets. That'd be so cool. I'd totally do that as well. I mean, pandas are just so cool, right? Comment down below if you like pandas, because I love pandas. All right, and then it was down this side. Hello, frogs. Sorry to interrupt, but I got to come down and complete the chunk. All right, where did we dig down? It was over here, wasn't it? Yeah, okay. The pig's just guarding it for us, aren't you, piggy? Yeah? Okay. You just guard it for us okay it's actually kind of okay there it is i was gonna say it's quite hard to find out where we last left off but i managed to find it okay it's fine okay here we go now this is where we truly left off at so hello zombie what do you got there huh, you got some mangrove well unfortunately buddy i need that well i don't need it back i just need your xp to be honest but let's take some of this cobblestone though because we might need it i'm gonna dig down here what how did you even okay well i don't know how that just happened all right that was weird I how did that happen I'm actually quite confused. But let's see what we got down in the next chunk. Another spiral staircase yet again. Oh, we got a little sneak peek. Here we go. Here we go. Right, so we're going to have to grab some cobblestone out of our inventory. And then we're going to use this invisible wall to our advantage. Look at that. Oh, that would do some serious damage. You don't want that stuff falling on top of your head. I can ensure you that. Right, well, let's carry on building the spiral staircase down. Right, so now we made it down here. Oh, we got some coal... Ah, we got some iron here. Hopefully there's a lot of it. Or no, maybe just this one chunk. It's fine. We get what we're given, okay? We'll take it. We'll take it. We've got five pieces there. Okay. Oh, even more iron. Some more coal. Definitely take that for sure. Nice XP for us also. Oh, I can hear whales. Is that... Oh, look at this. There's some whales. Oh my gosh, no way. Oh no. Okay, well, we've got to be careful for those guys, but... Oh, some more iron. I thought I could hear a whale. I got happy there for a second because uh, they're quite friendly, aren't they? Nice, there's some more iron this side. We don't mind if we take this. Look at that, 16 pieces of raw iron in total. Okay, that'll definitely do the job for now. Any more of it? Yeah, okay, there is a lot of it. Oh, and here as well. I almost missed this bit. Let me take this up. Lots of iron on this one, that's for sure. These drip stones are really, really dangerous, to be honest. If they fall on your head, then it is... It is game over. Okay, I thought I could hear zombies, but that is from the spawner, isn't it? So I haven't got to worry about anything just yet. You know, as long as they're not on this level, it's fine. 
I don't want to get attacked. Uh, okay, we're going to have to build a little staircase for this part because... Oh, no. How are we going to do this? Where does the water actually start? Okay, it starts from down here. So can we... If we mine this side, maybe... Just maybe we can sort of build a staircase leading down to this. This side. Like that. And then like that. <gasps> okay, let's be careful. Let's be careful. Well, we just got attacked. What do you guys think? I mean, there's lots of them down there, so they're going to try and attack us. Because there's quite a lot down here now, isn't there? Okay, 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 okay. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Ow. I need to go down and break that spawner, I think. Right. Okay. We're going down, we're going down. <sighs> okay, okay. Okay, 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 okay. I get it, I get it. I'm sorry. Okay, this is going to be so hard. Right. <sighs> hmm. We need to work something out here. I think it was... Whoa. Okay, I'm going to chuck a load of stuff that I don't need over here. Um, I feel like I don't need, obviously, rotten flesh, that terracotta. Because there's lots of kelp down here. So if we can go and collect the kelp, honestly, I'll be pretty happy. But it's just these guys are so annoying. Okay, screw it. Let me just take some kelp up like that. Okay, there we go. Okay, he's so got four kelp there. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, that was almost game over there. They're so powerful. I don't know how we're going to go about this, honestly. We're just going to have to try and get some sly hits or something like that. I wonder how we're going to do this. Like, maybe go down, go for a hit and go back up. I think that's the best way. Oh, no, 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 no. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Okay, let's see our baked potatoes. I think we just got to keep repeating that. Yeah, I think we just got to keep going down, hitting them and coming back up. Okay, there's so many of them, though. Okay, come on. Okay, that's one, that's one. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Okay. They're so strong. I'm so slow. Oh, that was close. You've been trying to get rid of me, haven't you? Oh, no, 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 no. Our hearts, our hearts. Right, well, at least they're all gone now because they was an absolute nuisance. Oh, my gosh. Hello, zombie. No, oh, you're going to turn into a drowned, aren't you? Okay, there we go. Right. Okay, there's lots of iron here, which I'm not going to mine because that's going to take absolutely ages. Actually, I can mine this side because I can maybe mine it above water. Yeah, okay, here we go. That's better. Right, let's mine this iron. Honestly, those guys were tough, but we managed to get there in the end. That's all that matters. But they were putting up a fight. They weren't letting that go easy. Let's take all this kelp up because we need all of this kelp there we go right, there's lots of it floating around all right let's take the rest of this kelp up because that will be really good for the fuel oh there's some raw fish here i'll take that well some raw cod to be precise we're gonna get some bubbles and we're gonna go down and then we're gonna get rid of some of that sand and go down to the next chunk so let's quickly do that see if we can okay there we go right this is the hardest part is mining underwater this is the hardest part let's see how many we can get oh okay we we did it Oh, wow. Okay, right. Let me eat my baked potatoes. Look at this, though. Lots of glow berries. Whoa. Hello, fishies. Oh, there's axolotls down here. Look at the axolotls. Whoa. Okay. They're so cool. Axolotls are so cool. All right, let me go down here. Oop. Okay. Oh, what? some bone meal. What? what happened here? Okay, well, I'm going to drop some of that. I wonder what, what happened here, but hello, axolotls. Are you guys just chilling? Oh, okay. Ah, what are you doing trapping me inside of that? What are you doing? I'll definitely take some of this. You guys know me. Well, I'm chilling with my axolotls right now, which is pretty cool. Um, There's lots of iron down here, so I'm going to go and take some of this up. I love me some iron. I mean, apart from glowberries and iron and some cool axolotls, there's not a lot going on down here. We, got, we have 45 pieces of raw iron in total, which is quite a lot. Hello, little axolotl what are you doing bro what are you doing hmm hold up a minute yo give me my give me my lead back i'm gonna take this pink one wait where did the pink one go i'm gonna take one up with me if i can okay you're coming with me okay all right come on what what are you oh come on can you can you get up here oh there you go come on come up here i'm not gonna stop come on where did it go okay it's here it's going crazy come on please come up there we go come on come on come on okay well it broke my lead. Well, obviously, I can't take the axolotl up, can I? On the way up, I also remembered that I have a potato and carrot farm, which I completely forgot about. So let me take this up real quick, and then we can head back up to the top. But I need me some food. Food's important, so we're going to prioritize this, okay? Hello, buddy. You're just giving us some um, company? Is that what you're doing? You're just watching us plant our carrots? Well, you can watch. You're, you're fine. You're all good. All right. Now we've done that. I'm actually going to go ahead and drop this bone meal real quick. And then, all right, let's head back up to the top like we was going to do originally. Okay, let's check our stone. Nice. All right, that's all done. So now, right, let's sort this out. So this kelp is going to give us some dried kelp. And with the dried kelp, we can turn it into a kelp block and then put it in the furnace and use it as fuel. As every single one of you guys know already, okay? You guys get the point right. Our trees have also grown quite a lot, if you haven't noticed already. Look how satisfying this is, though. It's all in line with each other. Look, this bush is all in line. Okay, so we need nine pieces, so we need another five. Okay, now we need two more. Come on, hurry up. 
let's deposit some stuff in the chest though, like some cobblestone, for example. Okay, there we go. Right, now we can craft our first dried kelp block. I mean, look at it though. It looks quite boring if I'm being honest. Okay, well, we're going to take that back up. We're going to wait till the others smelt into some dried kelp and then we're going to craft them all into some blocks. How's our animals getting on there? Let's go back to our farm. Okay, the wheat definitely needs taking up. So let's go and take some wheat up, making sure we get every last piece. Can you get out of my way, fisherman? Thank you. Thank you. C clear off a moment. I'm just placing my seeds. I don't need you right behind me right now, okay? Right, that's a lot better. Okay, we can do some more cows. So let's give you guys some wheat. You know, do your thing. And then chickens. Okay, I have a lot of chickens. Wow. Let's get rid of some of you guys real quick. Sorry about this. Oh, hang on a moment. I completely forgot about that steak. Well, I'm going to go put that in there. And then also some raw chicken. What else have we got? We've got some raw cod now, which is cool. Uh, we also got some more raw potatoes. Got some carrots. We've got more eggs. Like I say, we don't really need them in here, but it's whatever. And then I think that's it. Then if I go in here, I can put some more wheat seeds and wheat in here as well. Okay, we've got lots of food now. That's really nice. But if we take some of our wheat, we can go and make some bread. So I'm going to make some bread with all of this. Well, not all of it, but quite a lot of it. Actually, you know what? I might as well just use all of it. There we go. Right, 21 pieces of bread. Nice. That'll do the trick. Give us some mutton. Whoops. No, 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 no. You guys are definitely getting slain now. Okay, right. Let me get rid of you. Don't try and escape. I know what you guys are up to. I'm not silly. Let's put some raw food in here that we can cook for now. We're going to put some of our raw mutton in here. Let that cook. After that, we're probably going to cook some raw chicken because that's quite good. But let's Let's go to bed. Let's go to bed first. All right, morning time again. Right, let's see how dried kelp's getting on. Come on, one more. One more and I can do another block. Okay, there we go. All right, let's go. One, two, three. Bada bing, bada boom. Okay, the cooked mutton's nearly done. We just need one more piece and then we can put the raw chicken in. So our food sources are looking... Oh, sorry about that. Our food sources are looking very strong at the moment. How is our sheep and... Oh, hang on a moment. We've got some XP to collect because we got a little baby cow. There we go. Much better. Right. These guys are really trying to escape, aren't they? They're really scared. I feel bad. I feel bad. Like they're trying to get outside of the trap doors. I feel terrible. Not to worry, though. How many more pieces of dried cap have we got? Six. Just three more, then. In the meantime, I think we should just rip for our axe. Well, axes, we got quite a lot. Starting with a birch wood. That's right. Drop those birch logs. That was expected, but it's fine because we have backup. Moving on to the oak now. I think it's much easier if we just go down in a line like this. Drop for us. Okay, and let's move on to this. Our favorite. Okay, <laughs> as expected, it broke. Let's get rid of some of this. Oh, yes. Wow, look how satisfying that is. Can we destroy that? Okay, there we go. Wow. Maybe it's a little bit difficult with the spruce logs, but with everything else, it manages quite fine. But anyways, we got our wood that we needed. Look how much wood we've gathered from that. All right. Almost done. Just got to this end. I'm not even going to bother with the birch ones anymore, I don't think. I've got quite a lot. I've got way more than I actually need. I'm just going to stop placing those. And I'm going to replace it with more oak ones. We can go ahead and take the coal out. Put some of this dried kelp in, the dried kelp blocks, and then smelt some of this raw iron. And that should keep fueling for quite a while. Let's make ourselves a fresh iron pick, because ours is definitely going to break any second. I'm going to make myself an iron leggings and also some iron boots. So I can take the gold off, and now we're fully iron armor. Let's decorate this up a little bit, you know? We've got some decorative plants here. What else have we got? We can plant some of this down. Well, I need to replace this with some dirt. Have I got any dirt? Okay, I've got 14 pieces. I don't know if that's going to even be enough, but whatever. It's definitely not going to be enough. Originally, the sand was with the uh, sugar cane and the water and everything, so that's why it's all stony. All right, so let's just start filling this in of what we can. But well, I'm going to go to bed because my villagers are quite tired, so I'll... let me just put myself to sleep. All right, that's much better. You guys fine now? You guys okay over there? Well, okay, well, I, even if you're not, then I don't care anymore because you've had your time. There's some dirt here, so I'm going to have to... T okay, that's brilliant. I'm going to have to take some dirt from here, unfortunately. Sorry about this. There we go. If we can try and sneak some underneath, then we don't have to break the, the dirt on the surface. I need to eat some baked potatoes before I start slowing down out of hunger. Also, we're yet to explore this nether, so we're definitely going to do that soon. It's a shame. I'm only two blocks short, but that's not a big deal. I can go back down and collect some more. Matter of fact, I can actually just take two blocks from here. We planted some of these flowers down, you know, to give it some nice decoration. Let's turn a lot of this into some stone bricks. Okay. And then also some stone brick stairs and also some stone brick walls. Well, let's wait till our iron is done and then we can put some cobblestone in here and turn all of that into stone as well. Let's cook some kelp. 
Hey, maybe I can decorate this, actually. I might place that there and that there, maybe? We've got some decoration going on. It looks pretty now. It actually looks... It looks a lot better than, you know, just plain grass box, I guess. Decor it's nice to decorate it up a little bit. Lots of oaks grown. I think, actually, all of the oaks grown, which we don't mind at all. Do you think we should start building the farm now? I think it's time to build the farm. What do you guys think? I think it's time to build a farm, right? So how much was it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So, okay, it was eight L and... What was it? One, two, three, four, five... Okay, there we go. And then, let's go ahead and place that there. Oh, and this side. With the iron ingots, we can make some nuggets. With these, we can go ahead and make some lanterns. Our favourite thing in Minecraft. There we go. Right, nine lanterns now. So, we can go and get rid of these nasty, normal torches. Ugh. Now, we've got some lanterns covering all the entrances. There we go. All right, then we can start collecting some dirt, but we need to free up some inventory space. Okay, right, now let's go down with our trusty iron shovels. And take some dirt up because we're going to need it for the farm. And on this farm, it's going to consist of basically that over there. Just, you know, some potatoes, carrots. I don't know how much I'm going to be needing, but I'm going to take at least like three stacks to be completely sure. Because I feel like that would be more than enough, hopefully. I always misjudge that for some reason, but don't quote me on that. I'm quite bad at calculating blocks on this game, but it's fine. I'm strip mining dirt. I never thought I'd be doing this in Minecraft, but here we are. Oh, we nearly fell down there, but it wouldn't matter because there's some water down there. Alrighty, the sun's going down, but it doesn't stop us from working hard. A hard day's work never hurt nobody. Remember that. Right, head back up the stairs. Eat some baked potatoes on the way to treat ourselves. Right, let's start building out here then. Start extending the dirt. Okay, so we've got to extend it out towards here. So the same length as this chunk. And we're going to be needing a lot more than three stacks, I've just realised. I told you not to quote me on it because I'm very unreliable. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, fifteen, sixteen, and finally, seventeen. This is our last stack. So we're going to have to make do for now. And then we're going to have to go back down and start farming some dirt again i told you look we're always one short ah i hate that that's so annoying okay it doesn't matter and i just want to mention while breaking these dirt blocks from the bottom of my heart guys the support you've been showing me is absolutely crazy from the bottom of my heart i just want to say literally thank you guys so much even the little likes the comments the subscribing it all counts it all makes a change so if you guys could please take your time out of your day and just even drop a like on the video or just let me know you know what you're doing today or whatever you're doing i just want to know whether that's studying sleeping if that's possible if you can comment that or if you just enjoy these long-term videos i want to know down below so make sure you let me know okay it all makes a difference but like I say, from the bottom of my heart, thank you guys so much. I, I really didn't expect to start YouTube and get this much support. So the real ones are listening to this right now. And if that's you, let me know if you're a real one. I always check the comments and read them. So I appreciate it. Okay, so it turns out we've got six dried kelp blocks in here. So what can we put in here? What can we... Okay, that, that's right. Let's put some stone in here for now. Well, some cobblestone to turn it into some stone. Let's go out here. And what have we got cooking here again? Oh, that's right. Dried kelp, of course. Okay, well, let's turn all of these into blocks. We've got six more dried kelp blocks to go into the furnace while that does its thing in there let's multitask and finish this side i already know it's not going to finish it but we try okay we're going to obviously we're not going to stop until we do this are we so worst case we're just going to have to go back down and get some more but actually do you know what for one side maybe we do have enough i don't want to speak too soon actually we have plenty i hope i'm right on that i really do i got this surely yeah okay right thank you finally okay we actually got something right for once there we have it there's this done for now oh we need to fence all this off okay right let's make more fences then 18 oak fences should do the trick and then maybe we should have an oak slab platform on the outside you know just to wrap around what do you think oh actually i have a better idea i have a better idea right let's get rid of this okay oh of course literally of course oh my gosh right okay well that's helpful isn't it well let's take some of that and then make an iron axe yes we're going to appreciate this axe and we're also going to have to sacrifice a few slabs unfortunately because i can't pick them up while i mine it right but what i'm actually going to do is i'm going to grab my trusty shears which are in this chest somewhere there they are and then i'm going to go over to here i'm going to collect some of this and i'll show you why in a second it's for strictly decoration purposes only and i'll show you what i'm going to do with it in just a second when i can obtain enough okay i'm not going to lie this should actually be enough yeah, okay, we got like over two stacks, but I'm going to collect it, all of it if I can. Just as much as I can. Really. <gasps> okay, that was so close. Oh, that 100 days could have all come to an end there. I've got to be very careful. Okay, there we go. Right, let's see what we can do with this. And then I'm going to show you what we're going to do for our farm to make it nice and special. And then we're going to place some of this down for decoration. What do you think? Are we liking this idea? Hang on a moment. Let's see what, let's get a rough idea what it will look like. Yeah, I, I like it. 
Okay, I like it. I've got to stop wasting stuff, I know, but I'm not going to make my farm too big. I'm going to wrap this stuff all the way around this farm. Okay, like that. So, you know, we've got a bit of privacy. We've got, like, our own garden. It's enclosed. It's private, even though I don't know who's even going to be spying on us while we do our gardening. Well, actually, the villagers might. You know, we might have to... We might want some privacy away from the villagers. So, we've got our little bush here now to protect us. And then, what we're going to start doing is we're going to get some of our water buckets, if we've got any. Okay, we've got two here. So, what we can do is... Let's go and put that here and then let's start making like little water bits here like that and then we're going to go ahead and collect some more water and then we're going to hoe all of the dirt down and then get placing some of our potatoes and carrots as much as we possibly can we're going to steal well not necessarily steal also while we're at it let's take some of our potatoes that we'll be needing also carrots there we go and then let's head back up to the top real quick and then place some more water down and then we'll make a little iron hoe and then also hoe it all down and turn it into a nice little farm and we need to eat some more potatoes potatoes because we keep getting hungry actually let's eat some cooked chicken let's treat ourselves for once okay it looks like we need to go back to sleep right now it's daytime once again let's get our water buckets and let's place some here and also where else do we think i'm gonna place one just here as well i didn't actually mean to make it symmetrical but i i actually have let's go to the crafting table oh hang on a moment we need to empty some stuff by the looks of things okay and then like that let's make two just in case you never be too safe nowadays and then let's get hoeing so what we can do is let's get our shovel right and then we can sort of do this okay and then we can start hoeing all of this down right and let's grab some of our carrots and plant them down like so so when these grow they're going to be nice and vibrant aren't they you know with the long stalks on them and in minecraft they look so nice when they're all fully grown okay have i actually got any more raw carrots though okay there we go and also we need some raw potatoes from here it's fine if we can't fill all of it for now because obviously we're going to use it anyways so it's fine it doesn't really matter but let's Go ahead and plant as much as we possibly can down. All right, so what's sort of like halfway here? Is it? Would you say it's like here? We're gonna place, like I said, as much as we can, which is. Oh, hang on a moment. We got, we got a few more. Hopefully, we can fill in this gap. Okay, only one more. It's always one. It's always one. All right, it's fine. But we're gonna let all this grow for now. But I quite like it. It looks pretty cool, honestly. We got our barn now, some farm and some wheat here going on. We got our wheat farm here, and then we also got our carrot and potato farm going on over here, and our tree farm over here and over here. What can we make over here? I wonder. We'll figure that out, okay? But we need to find some more diamonds. That is what we need to do. Why don't we just go on a hunt for diamonds real quick? I think that's the move, honestly. Wait, before we do that though, okay, our stone's getting on nice. Then let's make some more stone oh, okay i didn't mean to do that okay i did not mean to do that okay that was silly of me <laughs> why did i do that well at least we got that now but let's go on a hunt for diamonds we need diamonds that's that's what we need we need a diamond pick where do you even find diamonds here i mean unless you're literally mining every single block whoa was that are those squids falling? These axolotls are so cool. Tell me these guys aren't just so cool. Look at them. I love axolotls. Look at them. There's so many of them. And this pink one's my favorite. What do you guys think? There might be diamonds hidden somewhere here, though. Am I just digging down here for no reason? Is there any ores down here, I wonder? I think I hear lava. What the heck? Oh, okay, wait. There's iron here. Hopefully diamonds. I wonder what the next chunk is. I can hear lava. It must be like a big cave or something like that. I'm not sure, but let's dig down. Maybe I've got to be very careful because I can hear lava and it's very close. Oh, okay. Now I can hear spiders as well. Oh my gosh. Wait, is that a diamond? Wait, yes, we found diamonds. No way. Oh my gosh. Yes, finally. Okay, okay, okay. Right, let's plant that torch there. I can hear spiders though, so I've got to be very careful. But what's in this chest? Oh, a golden apple? Some more torches, which would be very helpful, actually. There's some more iron there as well. Especially, look at this. Diamonds. Oh, we finally got more diamonds. Okay, finally. So we, we hit like a mine shaft. Is that a spawner, maybe? Oh... What's this in here? Okay, I think we're safe for now. So let's go ahead and take those diamonds up. I knew it. I knew there was diamonds somewhere here. Oh, yes, there's loads. I don't mind if I do. I don't mind if I do. Oh, yes, baby. Look at that. Three diamonds. Okay, I need to light this place up. Okay, and I'm not going down there. Okay, I need to break that spawner. Oh, my gosh. Look at him. I can see them. Oh, wait. Can they... They can't attack me from here, can they? So if I like... Wait, no, they can. Okay, they can. I knew that was going to happen. But I can hit you through here, can't I? Oh! <gasps> Oh, no. Okay, I did not expect that. So I need to be very careful now. Can they crawl through there? I don't, okay, I don't think they can. Right, we need to find a way to break this spawner. <gasps> oh, I knew that was going to hit us. Okay, block that up for now. Oh, my gosh. Okay, right. Where is that spawner? We need to, okay, there's a spawner. So that means we need to break some of this this way. Okay. Okay, the spawner's right there. Can we even get to it? Let's check. Let's check. Right, I can hear lava, so I've got to be very careful because I don't want none of that pouring on top of my head. Okay, right. This is going to take 
ages to break, so please bear with me. All right, that's one down. Last one to go. And then we can get rid of that little spawner. Almost done here. Come on, break. There we go. Right, now we can get rid of this spawner here. Okay, they're stuck, which is good. I'm not complaining. I don't want to get stuck in all of that, though, so <laughs> I'm going to be very careful. I'm going to dig this way. What if there's more diamonds, though? There's lava. Oh, oh, emeralds. Nice. Whoa, okay, this is really risky. Well, let's go ahead and dig around here, see what else is around here. Some more gold. How many emeralds? Is this just one emerald here? Yeah, I think it is. There we go. We got our first emerald. Wait, where did that go? Okay, there it is. Wow. I thought it fell in the lava for a second. I was literally about to cry. Okay, right, we've got one emerald. I wonder what else is around here. Is there anything else around here, or is this just it now? I think I'm just literally mining a whole bunch of nothing to be... Oh, never mind. Just as I was about to turn around. You know that one Minecraft meme where he's about to hit the diamonds and he turns around? Well, that was literally what was about to happen, but... Let's collect our other emerald then. Nice. Now we've got two emeralds. I wasn't expecting to find any emeralds here, to be honest, but I'm not complaining. <gasps> I thought I just fell in that for a second. I can't even explain to you how... I actually thought I fell in the lava. That was extremely close. I, I don't think I even could have got any more closer to that. Right, let's be very careful there. Okay. Oh my gosh. Right, okay, okay. So what's this side then? Is it nothing? I want to go back. Okay, right. I don't think there's anything else here now. So where did we come from again? We come from around here, wasn't it? Oh, almost just pushed that off. Was it up here? Yeah, okay. I think it was up here. So let's go back up here then. Light this up so we know where we came from. I wonder if there's any other diamonds around this part though. Because we found diamonds that corner. You know, them might be some more well there's iron here so while i'm here let me take that there might be some more diamonds that i'm missing i just remembered we have two back up at the top so that brings us to five diamonds take all of this iron up unfortunately axolotl you have to stay down here for now even though i tried bringing you up but you just didn't you weren't having any of it so it's not my fault okay you miss out you snooze you lose i might bring some water buckets down as well to bring into the lava then to turn into some obsidian because then we can enter the nether and then you know start collecting some blaze rods and etc we'll go explore the nether in a second but i can hear skeletons i don't know if that's Okay, that's evidently... Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Okay, 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 okay. Right, we need to go, we need to go, we need to go. Oh, that was close. What was all these mobs doing down here? I need to play some torches, I think. What the heck? Okay, I think they're all fighting each other. Right, this is... Okay, what is going on? This is a big free-for-all. Come on. Yes, you with the enchanted bow. Help me. <laughs> yes. Okay, Enderman, I need your Ender Pearls. Right, I might just jump down there, actually. Okay, come on. There we go. And then, let's drop some of that. Oh, hold up a moment. Yeah, actually, let's take some of that arrow. And then let's drop that cactus. Come on, Enderman, I need your Ender Pearls, buddy. I'm sorry for this. You gonna attack back, or? Okay, there you go. Yay! Our first Ender Pearl, I believe. Is that our first Ender Pearl? Oh my gosh, that Ender Man is so loud. But yeah, I think that's our first Ender Pearl. So I'm going to go ahead and click these arrows just in case we get a bow and enchant it and we don't get infinity because you know what our enchant luck is like. It's not the best. So <laughs> yeah, let's go from down here all the way up to here like this. Some more coal there and iron. But I honestly, I, th I feel like we're being a little bit greedy when we say this, but I don't think we need it. I genuinely don't think we do right now. We're quite well off of our resources at the moment moment but i'm gonna take these poppies up and then i'm gonna go back up to the top craft myself a nice diamond pickaxe because why wouldn't i maybe crack on with a farm you know harvest some crops i've got to be careful that there's no mobs though because i was caught by surprise a second ago by lots of skeletons and there was even a creeper there but hello my panda friends since when did you guys get up here okay one more chunk and we're at the top we're gonna leave our ender pearl in here okay so let's not forget that but oh look at the two diamonds oh and we've got more emeralds now what trades can we get i don't think we can get the best trades right now can we no okay where did the other go no okay you are yeah i'm not gonna do any trades with you guys you guys are scammers and i think it'd be wise if we made our first diamond pickaxe so let's hit the crafting bench and then three on the top and just like so, we have our first diamond pickaxe. Hooray! Nice. And then how is our carrots getting on? Look at this. We're going to have to free up some space for this. Oh, also accidentally harvest some potatoes, but that's fine. Take all of our carrots up. Nice. Nice. All right, there we go. All right, let's take our carrots. As you can see, we got quite a few carrots from that. So let's place some back. Okay, done for the carrots. And now it's the potatoes turn. Oh, yeah. There we go. Now let's hoe the rest of this down. I don't know if the water will actually hit that side. It should do, right? And we are ready to rock and roll. That looks pretty cool, though, honestly. I really like it. Let me maybe plant some... Uh, what can we do here, actually? Maybe for some design? I, I have an idea. I have an idea. Let's get some wheat... Have we already got any? Okay, no. Right, two seconds. Let's get some wheat. Okay, and we're going to make some cool blocks to go with a design. All right, let's cook some potatoes. Right, and then let's make some walls. We need to take some wheat. And then with this wheat, we're going to make some hay bales. 
Okay, and I'll show you why in a second. You can probably guess why. There we go. Right, six hay bales should do the trick. We can head back over to the food farm, if you will. Plant that here, and then like that. Okay, so, you know, we've got some decoration going on. What do you think? Is that cool? I like it. It's, I think it looks pretty cool. Okay, so... Might as well put it there. And as you can see, we've got some lighting now. So even though it's dark and, you know, it's scary, we can harvest our vegetables in peace. But let me quickly go to sleep real fast. And I also need to get rid of these floating chests. I don't know why I've had them there for so long. Let me get rid of all of that. Okay, I need the chests. Let me hit all this in here. And then let's plant these just here. And then what we can do is we can get this furnace here. And we can go ahead and plant the furnace right here. And then we can make another set of chests. Right, let's plant that here. Let's plant that there for decoration, okay? So, you know, we've got some hay bales over there for decoration. We've got some stone cutters, some chests, you know, things that we're actually going to need. So, it clears it up a lot. And this bed, I'll show you what I'm going to do with this. I'm going to make a little underground sort of bedroom. But look how much cleaner this looks now. It looks really nice, doesn't it? Right? So, let's go in the barn. And I think what we should do is here, right? We should have a little... Okay, I don't know how I'm going to do this. I need a water bucket. That's how I'm going to do this. And take some of this up. Okay, so you can see the hole over here. So, I'm going to go down, build a little room and make it a bedroom for us i'm gonna run over to my barn plant that there for now right and then place that here go ahead and grab some of our oak logs we can start extending this down to make another room okay hold up a moment i'll sort that out in a second right actually let me make it a little bit more bigger okay oh i need air right now let's make some ladders let me take this water here let me go to the crafting table turn some of these into planks and sort this situation out. i'm just go ahead and do that and then i can make some ladders let me just craft some more real quick what we can do is we can plant some of these down here okay I just need one more ladder. One more ladder. And I'm sacrificing a bit of wood here, but it's fine. All right, there we go. Now we have enough. What we can do is here, we can plant that there. And then grab our oak slabs and then build out. It doesn't need to be that big, does it? We're only using this to go to sleep, really. And let's go make a bunch of slabs and get building this. And I'll show you what I'm going to do with it. Let me go and turn half of this into some planks so we can use it to fill the walls in. Maybe we can make some glass for some windows. Or because it's a barn, we might make out of trap doors or something like that. We'll figure it out. I'll, I'll show you. Let me extend out a little bit here there we go right now we can extend out a bit so it's a bit more safer for us I need to make some more slabs, but that's not a problem for us. We're literally rich in wood right now, so it's fine. Okay, honestly, I think this is big enough for us. So let's make our little pillars And then all we got to do is come along now like this and we're gonna make some windows Okay, and just so I don't forget I'm gonna do the same for the top Otherwise, I've got to keep placing it when it's already done I'm gonna make two windows here and also this side as well. So it's nice and symmetrical. I'm gonna divide this up these are all going to be windows here. Let's place our bed here for now. And then I'm going to go ahead and make a crafting bench to place down here. Same for the other side. And then also followed up by some chests. Maybe like this. Now we can go and put our valuables in these chests. We have some bamboo actually. So if we grab some string. But let's go back up the top. Oh, is that a random... Is that a wanderer? Yeah, okay, yeah. Let's see if he's got any trades to offer us actually. Let's build up here. Okay, have you got any good trades for us? Wandering trader? No, not necessarily. Okay, they're kind of trash, so I'm going to get rid of you. Okay, and you, alpaca. Oh, don't spit at me. Imagine that's what actually got rid of me, an alpaca. <laughs> That, that would have been crazy. All right, well, he had no good trades for us. So what was, you know, what was it even worth my time? Where is the string? Okay, so we're going to have six pieces of scaffolding now that we can actually go ahead and place here like so. Okay, then we can get some, make some barrels as well. So we've got two barrels here. So let's go ahead and place them about here. We need some sand to make some glass. Okay, my carrots and potatoes are grew which is really nice look at this nice and green put that in here and smell some sand okay we have no flint i was gonna say i can make one of those fletching tables but never mind how's our glass getting on nice so i'm gonna place my glass like this right and then what i'm going to do is hold up a moment let's make some trap doors okay so what we can do is we can plant these like so uh hang on a moment quite bad with placing these so bear with me ah uh, there we go it's still giving that barn theme, so that's what we're kind of following here. Okay, and then just one here, and there we go. So we have some trap door windows here, but we're going to fill the rest of them with glass, because I think it looks better. We also need a lantern. Okay, and then what we can do is, okay, let's plant them here onto the scaffolding. That looks better, right? Go take up some more wheat while we're at it. I'm curious what the next chunk is. Well, I think we have an idea, but I'm not... I don't know, I don't want to take any 
accurate guesses to be honest. I want it all to be a surprise. After we finish doing this, I feel like we should grab a bucket of water. Okay, we already have one. Go down to that lava and take some obsidian. I already have a piece of obsidian, so I can get rid of this crying obsidian here. And then I can put it here. But yeah, I can pretty much mine this one here because you don't have to fill in the corners. So I can plant that here, which then I can repeat for the top. And then we go down to the lava, click some obsidian. And then turn this into a working, fully functional nether portal. And we also need some flint as well, don't forget. Alright, so back down, here we come. Turn all of this into obsidian. There we go. And let's quickly go through it, why don't we? We need to light this up now, because a lot of the lava's gone. It, um, it's quite dark now. We don't even have any torches. Oh my gosh. That's appalling from us, but we only need a couple more. I think we need, like, three more pieces. One... Two, three, yeah, I think we need three more pieces of obsidian. We're gonna we're gonna take four because I know what we're like. It is three, I'm pretty sure, but like, you know, you can never go wrong with having just enough, you know? Alright then. So let's head back up to the top now, have our obsidian. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Oh no 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 no. There's lo there's loads of mobs. Oh! Oh my what the heck? Hello, skeleton. <laughs> <laughs> what just happened there? That's what I deserve actually for not placing any torches. That is completely my fault and I take full responsibility. That is absolutely my fault. Any more mobs? Or am I going to get off lucky this time? Yeah, I knew this was going to happen. Wow, what a surprise. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Okay, okay, okay. Not so fast, little guys. Why is there so many zombies? It's the little ones that are the most violent. Okay, well, that should be a lot of the zombies cleared up. Let me eat some baked potatoes. There's a skeleton. And there's a creeper. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, I think that's it. No, I'm so wrong. I am so wrong. Oh, my gosh. What the heck? Oh, my gosh. What is going on? Okay. Oh, iron. I mean, I'm going to take that while I'm here, I guess. Okay, I... I'm just going to go for it. Hold up a moment. I need to take more cobblestone, I think. Otherwise, I'm going to be short of cobblestone. I thought I could hear loads of mobs, and obviously, there you go. Right, okay. I'm just going to make a run for it, I think. I'm going to eat some more baked potatoes, get to full hunger bars. And I think the only thing I can do from here is just really... Oh my gosh, there's more creepers. Okay, hold up a moment. I need more. Oh my gosh, this is so scary. Please, not like this. I don't want it to end now. There's so many mobs. I don't want to take any silly risks. And it's becoming morning. Oh my gosh, my iron sword's about to break as well. Oh no, 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 no. Okay, I need to make a crafting... Oh, actually, there's a crafting table down here, isn't there? Okay, hold up. Right, hang on a moment. Let's make an iron sword. Oh my gosh, I'm so bad at crafting. What is going on? Right. Okay, is that it? All right, okay, all right. Now we're ready. Oh no, enderman. We're just going to have to make a run for this. Actually, wait. Please drop an enderpearl. Yes! Oh! Oh no, 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 no. Oh my gosh, please don't blow up. That was close. All right, here we go. I need that ender pearl. Oh, yes. Okay, right. Which way is the way up? It's here, it's here. Oh! Oh my gosh. Wait, I think it got rid of this skeleton, right? Okay, well, we'll take this ender man on then. Yes, another ender pearl. Nice. Okay, so that brings us to three ender pearls in total because we also have one at the top, don't we? So let's go. All right, let's go back up to the top. And there's another spider. There's so many mobs everywhere. What happened? Oh, I'm just, I'm just worried about the creepers, honestly. What the heck? Why didn't that... Block. Right, let's get back up to the top as soon as we can. So we're back at the nether portal now, and we have our missing obsidian pieces, and just one like that, right? Okay, now we have a full working nether portal, but there's only one thing missing, it, and that is the flint and steel, and we need that, obviously, to power the nether portal. So let's go hunt for some flint. Firstly, I'm going to craft myself a shovel just so I can get through it quite quickly. So I'm going to put two sticks in here, and then obviously one on the top for a shovel. Let me get my baked potatoes out just in case I run out of hunger. And then I'm going to go down now. I'm not sure where the gravel actually was but i'm gonna go and locate it and dig it up oh hello buddy that's actually a really nice chill spot i um i respect it okay gravel hello gravel come on drop me some flint please is it like a 10 percent chance to get flint oh there we go okay we've got one flint here nice and just like that, we can now craft our first flint and steel. Okay. Well, at least we have our first flint and steel now. And you know what I just realized? We're not really using this no more. So, huh. What can we... Oh, I've got an idea. So let's get some sand, right? And let's get our shovel back out. All right. So let's take all of this dirt up. And then we're going to place our sand down like so. And then we're going to go back up the top, grab some sugar cane. And we can start growing sugar cane along here because we haven't got any sugar cane farms. So we had to destroy the original one. And I just forgot to replace those with windows. Okay. Well, we'll light the nether portal in a second. All right. I'm pretty sure the sugar cane's in with all the rest of the farm stuff. Let me go and grab that. Now we've just got to run back down really quickly and place some sugar cane all right so all i gotta do is just place it like so there we go 
Right, now I'm just got to wait for this to grow. Oh, I don't know why, but I just really wanted to place those there. Don't ask, but I just think it looks all right. It gives it a little bit of character, okay? All right, so we're going to wait for this to grow. And at least now we actually have our own sugarcane farm. But that's really bothering me over there. So I'm going to go and... Oh, I thought that was someone in my house there. I'm going to go fill in the windows with glass. If I remember, it's in here. Yep. All right, so let me go down here and let me just fill the rest in with glass. The only thing is I'm next to my noisy animals, so I struggle to sleep at night here because they're quite noisy. Come on. There we go. Is that all of the glass done? Yeah, that's pretty much it. So actually, no, I'm going to put my valuables in these chests. Right, so I'm going to put some obsidian, maybe some iron. What else can I put in here for now? Um, I think that would do it for now. I'm going to go and grab my diamonds and emeralds and everything and go and put it in that chest as well. Is it in this chest? Okay, no, there's another ender pearl here, though, so I'll take that real quick. Okay, where are my diamonds? Are they in here? Yeah. Okay, so my diamonds, my emeralds. Might take some gold as well, you know, some gold stuff. Oh, I actually can't. Let me just put some stuff in here. Some bamboo and stuff. All right, that should do it. We'll just put some of our valuables in the chest. I can go down here please. Thank you. And then let's put it all in here. So we've got three enderpearls in total. I need to eat some baked potatoes again. Wow, my hunger really isn't lasting out here. I feel like I should place a, maybe a little dark oak trap door here or something like that because it's quite difficult to uh, get down there. There we go. Right, let me go and place these down. Well, one of them down, should I say. There we go. That's better. So now it's a bit hidden. Okay, so, but now we have our flint and steel, we can go back to the nether portal and we can actually go and check it out because I'm not, I don't know what to expect, honestly, but we're going to go and find out. So let me quickly light this real quick. There we go. And now we have our first official nether portal fully functioning. I feel like we should bring some cobblestone or something like that in the meantime. Just in case. I feel like we need like a lot of blocks for the nether. So I'm going to take some just so I've got it. Okay. How's our shield getting on? Our shield's looking kind of weak if I'm being honest. So I'm going to craft myself another shield. I'm going to put this beaten up one in here for now. And then put the new one on. And we have a fresh shield now. Let me pick this sugar cane up. And let me just put it in here. I feel like we should deposit it some stuff that we don't need you know okay all right and i feel like we should just go and head in and really see what what's going on all right well here goes nothing okay we made it and oh my gosh okay i don't know what i expected but it wasn't that i didn't expect blazes straight off the bat what is this oh my gosh okay well let's go and take you guys out ah ouch there we go oh my gosh well i didn't expect that off of the bat okay what is this place is this it or can you dig down? Is there different chunks to it? There's got to be, right? I'm going to build this here so I don't get attacked while I'm trying to go back. What is this place? Can I go up? I'm going to try. So let me try and build up real quick. Uh-oh. Ah! Is that what we're doing here? I'm going to take you on, though, because I want your blaze rods. Okay, let's try and make our way up. Can we go up here, or is there nothing above us? Oh, look, we're about to find out. Oh, no. Okay, there's just a barrier here, which is bedrock, which unfortunately we can't mine. So I'm guessing we just go down then. Should we try and make a little spiral going down here maybe or without being interrupted by any blazes? I'm going to have to try and sneak over this side because there's a little bit of land here. So I think that's the only thing we can kind of do here. Let me eat my potato because we might have to prepare for some war in a minute. Do we just dig down from here or? Okay, this is really risky and I do not like it, but... I am going to try and dig down and see if there is actually anything down here. There's got to be something down here, surely. I don't know what I'm expecting. Oh, okay, some soul sand. So this definitely tells me there's something down here. Let's keep digging. Oh, okay, what is this? Oh, hello, skeletons. Okay, there's something over there that we could build over to. So let's try and dig our way through here without being interrupted by any skeletons whatsoever. Yeah, don't mind me, guys. I'm just passing through, okay? I mean no harm to nobody. I wish I had a bow and arrow at this point. Maybe that's what I need. So let's build down. Okay, so now we can sort of mine all of this and start maybe spiraling down a little bit now. Can we do that? I definitely need a bow and arrow at this point. Don't mind me, skeletons. Whoa, that was extremely close. Okay, okay, okay. There's only two, so I should be fine. There we go. Okay, this is what we need. Right, who's your bets on, guys? Who's your money on? Oh my gosh. There's a massive free-for-all. Ah, no, now they're all targeting me. Oh, there we go. Okay, this is more entertaining and fun for us. I'm going to take advantage. We got some bone block. Are we going to use this? Probably not, but I like the sound of it. How satisfying is that noise? But like I say, and you guys always know I say this, but the nether is my least favorite place to go, but... We kind of have to do it. It's just one of those things that you kind of got to do. But that doesn't mean I'm enjoying my stay here. Okay, I don't I don't like it. But let's keep going down then. Oh no, I can hear... Oh no, hang, hang on a moment. Oh my gosh. Okay, the question is how am I going to get down though? I need to take some of this netherrack. 
And not just some, actually. I need a lot of it. Oh, is this a bastion? Wait, so if we... Ah, okay. Oh, no. Okay, I, I have no idea how we're going to do this without a bow, but... Oh, my gosh. If I can get them all to fall down here... Would that work? Yeah, okay, fall. Yes, fall. Fall down. Fall down. But I will take some of this nether rack up. Okay, I'm going to have to pick these guys off from a distance. So if I just maybe spiral down a little bit here, this might be a really bad idea. But this is what we're going to have to do. Oh, my gosh. Hey, buddy. I'm actually doing this with no bow and arrow. Oh, my gosh. And with an iron sword, by the way. Not even a diamond one. Yes, fall down. Hang on a moment. If we get them to fall down, will they... Yes, fall down. Yes. I can take you on, right? I need to eat some baked potatoes right now. Oh, my gosh. He was comboing us up there for a second. Okay. Hello, bro. Get down there. All right. If we maybe try and mine the top of this and get our way inside. Oh, okay. There's a ladder there. Is there any chests anywhere or any good loot for us? Oh, I see the chests. I've got to be very careful here. I've got to be so careful. Whoa, look at those guys down there. I do not like those. I do not like those at all. Let's see if we can try and make our way down, but be very careful while doing so. Okay, that guy's got a crossbow, so I'm definitely trying to avoid him. Okay, maybe if we make a little spiral down here. Okay, okay, okay. Right, okay, so we made it down here, and oh, that's quite handy to know. I might just take some of this in case I need it. Don't mind if I do. Oh, come on, guys. Can't we all get along? Hang on a moment. I'm just going to drop a golden nugget. I'm going to try and build my way down if I can. <laughs> Make sure you drop a like because this is risky. Okay, anyone down here? Or well, not really. Okay, there is someone there. Oh, okay, I'm going to have to try and build a spiral like this, aren't I? Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm blocking this off. There's a spawner there. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Okay, okay, block that back up. That was a bad idea. I don't like this place. No, 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 we can be friends, we can be friends. Actually, no, we can't because you're annoying me. We can work our way down this side and get rid of this guy like that. Okay, missed. Can we... No, we can't. Okay. Never mind. Okay, I'm going to use some basalt. I'm going to place this here so they can't jump up at me. I need to focus on this guy. Oh my gosh. I need to eat my baked potato. I've got to be, I've got to be strategic about this. Oh, there we go. All right. Nice, 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 nice. What is in these chests? Can I hit them from down here? Okay. Oh. Oh my gosh. Okay, there's so much I need to get rid of him. Oh no. Uh oh. Okay, I feel like I can hear someone creeping up behind me. I don't like it. Oh, okay, right. Hang on a moment. We need to get rid of a lot of stuff. What do we get rid of, though? So now if we hit this chest again. Oh, yeah. Gold, golden carrots, some leather. What is this? A banner pattern? A snout? Oh, some netherite scrap. Some more leather. Golden carrots. I need this guy to leave me alone. Okay, I can hit him from here. He's fine. Wait, no, I shouldn't have done that. Wait, let me cover this up. There we go. Okay, no one can get in, right? I don't think so. Right, well, let's quickly loot all of this. Oh, Okay, some lodestone, uh, some more carrots, some more gold, iron, golden apples. Nice. We'd take all of it. We'd take all of it. And I'll take this music disc as well, because why not? Was there any other chests or was that it? Okay, I'm pretty sure that was it, right? Hey, guys, what are you doing? Okay, I feel like I should get out of here or maybe dig down and see what else is down here. Okay, I'm going to block this in. Oh, gosh, I should have seen that coming. I've got to be careful here. Any down here? Okay, no, we're fine. Okay. Look how many... Oh, no, 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 no. This is extremely dangerous. Look how many there are. Look at them. They're going mental. No way. I don't think we can go down here. They sound pretty angry. And I haven't got much blocks on me. Yeah, I'm gonna... I might just have to... Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Where did they come from? Look at them. If I jump down there, it is, it is game over for me. So I am minding my own business. And I'm gonna just make my way back up to the top, I think. I got what I need. I got my loot. I choose life. I have actually no blocks to build with. Oh my gosh! Okay, we're gonna have to take you guys on. I've completely messed this spiral up. Oh gosh. Okay, at this point, I don't even care. Just get me home. Okay, we're back at the nether portal. I feel like we should get some more blazers though while we can. What the heck? What is that guy doing up there? Alright, okay. Oh. Right, let's get rid of you. Nice. Oh my gosh. Okay, nice. Got more blaze rods, so that's pretty cool. What is this guy doing down here though? He's trying to jump up. They're always trying to jump up all the time. Oh, wait, did another one spawn or am I just imagining that? I think I am imagining that. I can hear another one though. Oh, it's there. Oh no, wait, why are they spawning behind now? Oh my gosh. Okay, there's too many of them now. Let's get this guy. Nice, he dropped a blaze rod as well. Okay, oh, there's literally loads of them just scattered everywhere now. They're spawning behind the actual like invisible barrier though. But anyways, we're going to go back because I'm not risking anything in here and I hate this place. 
All right, but now we're eventually back. Okay, I'm so pleased to be back. We're going to hit the hay and we're going to go to bed. All right, finally, a nice, bright, sunny day. Oh, my gosh. I've never been so happier to hit that bed. I love you, sheep. I'm sorry for leaving you guys. Let's see what we got from that. We got a lodestone. That's interesting. We also got a lot of nether warts. We got, obviously, a music disc, some magma cream, netherite scraps, more gold, netherrack, more glowstone dust, a lot of golden apples, to be honest. Three is quite a lot. Then we got a banner pattern. But we've got five blaze rods and just some other bits and pieces, really. So, not too shabby. How's our carrot farm getting on? Actually, let's quickly take up some potatoes because this is the good stuff. We can go and actually cook this. We've got a stack of potatoes and this can be cooked in the furnace. I'm pretty sure there's some fuel and some furnaces over here. Let's make this our little nether chest. Okay. All of this in here. We've got lots of golden carrots. That's one thing I've noticed. Wait, let's take them. Where are the golden apples there? Okay, let's put them in here. So now we've got six. Nice. What should we build on this thing over here? I'm not sure what to build. What do you th what do you guys think I should build? Hmm, we've got a tree farm here. We've got our barn over here. And we also have a food farm. So what else is there to build over here? I mean, we can make some enchantments, right? We can make a little enchantment table or something like that, maybe? Let's go and do that then. Let's get some wood. Where's the wood? Okay, the wood's here. So let's just make some slabs. And then we're going to extend out. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five. Is it eight outwards, I think? I should know by now, shouldn't I? I'm quite bad with things like this. Six, seven, eight. Okay, let's have some fences on. Wait, what? what is that? What the heck? What are you doing here? Oh my gosh. What are you... Who told you you was allowed in here? What are you doing? Wait, I want you as a friend. You want this gold? You want this gold? You like it? Take the gold. Take the gold. Stop trying to eliminate me. But I will take my gold back, actually. All right, let's make some fences. There we go. 18 should do the trick for now. Have we got any more oak leaves left over, I wonder? Hmm. Maybe it's in the other chest. Yeah, okay, we have. So maybe we can do a little something with that. But let's connect some fences onto where our actual chunk is, like this. What we can do is we can make a little circle and make a little enchantment room. And we're going to make some bushes, like, around it, some oak leaves like this. You know, I'm kind of ruining the whole chunk vibe, but at the end of the day, it's special. It's an enchantment room, so, like this. And then two aside, and then three up, including this one I've already placed. So that's three, and then one like this, and then count it as five. So one, two, three, four five okay and then i'm gonna do the same what i've basically done and just make it symmetrical all right well after finally fixing it now we can go ahead and just fill in all the gaps and then on the outside we're gonna make it like we did for our farm over there with the leaves around it just you know wrap it all around okay well it looks like i need more slabs but let me go to bed first because like i say i don't want any phantoms attacking me all right nice so let's go back up to the top make some more slabs and fill the rest of the floor in so just fill this center in imagine we haven't got enough again I think it's going to happen to us. Yep, it definitely did. Where is the leaves? They're in here, aren't they? This might not be enough, so we might have to make some more shears and do it that way, but let's try. Just like this. It looks nice, though, doesn't it? It looks really nice. I like it. It's a shame I haven't got enough, though. I'm going to have to make some more shears, I think. Rough idea, though. That's what it's going to look like. By the time you put some lanterns in there as well and other stuff, it's going to look really nice. Okay, let's make ourselves another pair of shears. There we go. And then let's go to our lovely oak trees and take all of the leaves down. Okay, that should be more than enough. We always end up getting overs. But like I say, guys, I'd rather have enough than not enough. Remember that. Okay, and all we got to do is just place it on the top layer. And there we have it. It's done. And we're going to place our enchantment table around here and then put all the bookshelves around it so yeah we need lots of obsidian though so we might have to go and stack up on some obsidian but before we do that let's make some lanterns then make some torches and then put some iron in here make them to iron nuggets and then put them in like this okay i might like do a little something like this for each side what do you think i like it brightens it up a bit as well all right well now that's done we need to focus on actually getting the uh, enchantment table so let's go and grind some obsidian real quick okay so i think we need four pieces of obsidian right but let's see how our sugar cane's getting on has it grown yet yep there it is wow look at that let's go and take some of our sugar cane down we might okay instead of making this sort of all the way down i've got an idea that might be a lot easier as well let's take this up here and then we're going to do like a massive elevator made out of water okay then we're just gonna have to mine straight down all the way to the very bottom let me put this crafting table down so we can go ahead and make ourselves a bucket 
Okay, nice. There we go. It sort of separates the water a little bit, okay? Okay, so I run out of materials to actually carry it on, but let's quickly go to sleep before we get any mobs trying to attack us. But all we got to do is just get some more stone brick walls and then basically just keep placing them. Okay, we've got some stone bricks actually. Oh, and we've got some more here. We can go and make a ton more. We've got more stone bricks over here. That's more we can make. Sugarcane farm's getting on well again. Okay, and I'll show you what I've done with it. So it leads up until this point, okay? So you go down the ladders and then voila, you go down this. And if you want to get out of it, you can just... And then obviously go back in, go down, see every single chunk that you've actually done. Let's go as far as we can. We're just collecting some obsidian. We've already got six pieces, but I'm just going to collect seven because I don't know why. I just feel like collecting seven pieces, okay? Leave me alone. We just need to place a diamond and a book. We need to craft a book. That's one thing we need to do. We've nearly reached the top and there we go, up the ladder as we go and we're back to our homeland we have seven blocks of obsidian and there's our little enchantment room so let's head back up to the top craft ourselves a book and then get this enchantment table down so we've got our book and then all we have to do now is go and collect our diamond and then we can get crafting our first enchantment table but then all we got to make is the bookshelf so that's going to be the sort of grind part okay here we go so they're both in the two diamonds for some reason i thought it was one diamond when it's two but whatever so here's all our diamonds and we have our first enchantment table woohoo now then we can go up to the top and let's craft some bookshelves so we need three books and oh my gosh what are you doing here i think i heard a magma as well i hope not but i did hear one so i'm not quite sure about that but okay come on pig man thank you oh a little enchantment golden sword with smite two on it okay well let's make three books so we need some leather let's take some sugar cane for paper so let's make some paper Okay, there we go. So now we have a stack of paper. Okay, and all we need to grab is some wood. And before I get into that, let me go to bed. Because I need to go back down here anyways. So. Have we got any rabbit hide, I wonder? Because then we can turn that into some leather. But we've got cows there anyways. But have we got any? Okay, so we've got four bookshelves in total, which isn't enough. Breed some more cows, like so. And we're going to have to wait till they give us some more and take their leather. I'm going to place my enchantment table about here. Two, three, four. Take some of this wheat up. And replace it. Come on then, cows. I need more. I need some leather. Let's check on our food furnace. Okay, five baked potatoes. Go ahead and cook this raw beef. Oh, nice. Four pieces of steak. That'll go straight in the food chest. Followed up with this one as well. So that gives us 30 pieces of steak. Nice. I might need to make more paper, actually. So let me craft more paper. Once I've crafted more paper, we can go check on our cows and see how they're getting on and collect even more leather. Okay, here we go. We've got some XP. Right, come on, cow. Give me your leather. That's right, drop me all your leather. Finally, some more cows have grew, so let's go and slay them and take their leather. So after a long grind of just breeding cows and slaying them and so on, I managed to get the number amount of bookshelves that I needed, which is seven. So let's go back to the enchantment room and get these seven blocks placed down. Okay, and then it was like this. And one, two, three. Right, now we should get level 30 enchant, right? Okay, nice, nice, nice. Right, well, that's done. Have we got any lapis, though? Okay, we have six pieces of lapis. We actually need to go and find more diamonds, though, before we start enchanting, because I need a diamond sword. That is one thing I do actually need. See, the armor isn't a big deal to me. I just need a diamond sword. But yeah, so that's pretty much it for the enchantment room. So let me know if you like this. I like it. It's pretty clean. Looks nice, actually. It looks really nice. I like it. Although it's not too much, you know, it's just clean. It's, it's tidy. Listen, it's not an insane build, but it's just something to look nice, I suppose. I think we should head down, though, and try I find some diamonds because we really need a diamond sword before we even think about going to the end. I feel like if diamonds would be located anywhere, it would be somewhere like this cave. And oh my gosh, hello squid and little fish. What are you guys doing up there? You guys can't use my little water elevator thing. Who said you was allowed to use it? But we'll uh, we'll let it slide for now. But yeah, like I mentioned, if there was going to be diamonds around here, I'm pretty sure it would be around this cave. And I see some coal up here, so it'd be rude not to go and collect that. So I'm going to collect some cobblestone because I have no actual building blocks to go over and build to it. But regardless, I'm just going to collect this cobblestone real quick so I can just make my way over to this cobblestone. So if I make like a little bridge here, then maybe a little spiral leading up to it. And then I'm just going to mine it. Give us some XP as well. Nice. 
Oh, there's quite a lot of it as well. We do need to find diamonds though. I wonder how we're going to find those because this is going to be kind of hard. What chunk is below this one? Yeah, okay. It's like the little C one. Oh, there's more coal down here as well. So I don't mind if I do. Lots of coal actually. Wow. Okay, I feel like we need to craft a bit more torches as well because we're going to run out of these and I hate it when it's dark. So I might light this cave up a little bit. Okay, can we make this jump? Oh, there we go. All right, yeah. So I'm just going to place some random torches around. So actually no mob spawn here as well because like last time, there always is mobs spawning. And oh, look, there's a piece of coal over there that I didn't pick up. Let me go and collect that and take my cobblestone back. Uh, there we go. Right, nice. What was that down there? Oh, I don't know why I thought that was diamonds for some reason. Oh, look at this. Well, hang on a minute. I didn't know this was here. Oh, look at this. We got some amethyst. I didn't even see this. Ow. Well, I'll take some of this, actually. Maybe I'll use it. Maybe I'll use it. Just listen to the sound it makes. It's so charming. It's like it's about to sing me a lullaby. I didn't even see this down here. It's a shame there wasn't any chests with any diamonds in them because that would have been taken straight away. Okay, let me build my way back up. Okay, what was that? I think I heard something fall. I think it was just the squid, hopefully. Okay, hopefully that wasn't any mobs, but... Let's go down this chunk. Oops. Oh, there's some iron here. Wait, what is that? Okay, wait. How long will it take us to mine this? Quite a long time. If I mine down, will I find it? There we go. Okay. Ah. Okay, I'm going to take that piece of iron. It was just one piece, really? Well, okay, let's go down here, though. Some iron along these sides. So it still tells me that there might be some ores down here. What's down on this one? Okay, I doubt there's anything on this one, to be honest. But I need to mine down anyway for the water to run through. So if I just sort of stand over here. Okay. Sorry, Axolotl, but you might have to move out the way, buddy. Please. Okay, let me mine this. Oh, okay, there's some ores down. Whoa! Okay, we hang on a minute. We actually found diamonds. What? What the heck? That is the weirdest place to put a diamond block. Well, okay, how do I stop this water a moment? Stop. Okay, I need to mine this underwater. Oh my gosh. Oh, okay, there's more. Okay, well, there's our diamond sword there. Is there any others? Yes. Okay, we need air though. Oh my gosh. Well, that was unexpected. I was not expecting that. I can't believe we found diamonds that quick. And in the weirdest position as well. Is there any more though? That is that is the question. No? Okay, three pieces. I can't be too greedy. I would definitely take that. But at least I know there is actually diamonds around here. I just got to look hard enough, I think. Imagine if I just mined that block and there was another diamond ore there. At least we have three diamonds now, so we can actually go ahead and craft our ourselves a diamond sword which is pretty cool to be honest oh there's more iron ore here as well Ooh, eat this baked potatoes i gotta be careful that any mobs don't spawn down here as well because they are known for spawning around me aren't they i'm so happy we got diamonds thank you for that minecraft gods thank you okay there's more iron ore this side Ooh, there we go all right let's go down this side well i want to go where the diamonds were so this definitely tells me there's some more diamonds around here somewhere okay let me just Hold up a minute. Let me cover this up, right? Let me break this clay. And then I'm going to mine down this side because there might be more diamonds down this side. I doubt there's any diamonds above here. Oh, gosh. Yeah, let's keep mining down here then to see if we can find any more diamonds. Let me light this up down here as well. I have a feeling there's going to be more diamonds around here. We definitely know there's diamonds around this area somewhere. Let me put a torch back here. Come on, diamonds. Where are you at? Show me your face. I need to prepare for the ender dragon. And you know what the ender dragon... Oh, my gosh. Wait. Yes. More diamonds. What the heck? No way. Um, okay, please tell me there's more though. Oh, okay, we need to fail down there, but please tell me there's more. Anywhere? Okay, no, I think there was only one ore there. Okay, we got four diamonds now. That is so cool. Okay, is there anything else around here? Okay, surely there's got to be more diamonds around here somewhere. Surely. Show yourself, diamonds. Okay, what's down this end? Nothing. No, okay, there's nothing down here. So, right, which way should we start heading? Should we mine down now? Maybe there might be some more diamonds down here. Let's mine down. I have no idea what the next chunk is going to be. Hopefully we find diamonds on the way. That'd be cool. Oh, what is that? Oh my gosh. Okay. 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 Um, I'm scared, but I see chests. And I need to go down and get those. Okay. Is there a warden down here? Because I really hope there isn't. Okay. 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 Um, I don't like that. Okay. What's in here? Oh, okay. I don't like this. I don't like it. I don't like it. This is so scary. What is this? Oh, enchanted golden apple, though. Some echo shards, some skulk sensors. I'll take these candles because they might look cool in my build. Oh, my gosh. Why are they so loud? Stop censoring me. Okay, let me get rid of these boxes. They give us XP. Oh, Swift Sneak 3. We've got a music disc in here as well. Some more bones. Okay, this is scary. Okay, I'm pretty sure the um, stronghold is below us because I can hear some creatures down here. I'm going to take a lot of this up, though, for XP because it's pretty good. Okay, let's see what's down here, though. I'm pretty sure it is a stronghold, surely. Oh, oh my gosh, here's the end portal. Ah, it's these guys. Okay, right, well, let's go down. I hate these guys. They're so annoying. They're so annoying. What's in this chest? Oh, another ender pearl. Some chorus fruit, more iron ingots. Okay, well, there we go. We have our first end portal, though. I mean, that wasn't hard to locate at all. You know, like, in normal Minecraft, you mean you'd have to 
go on a complete maze to try and find this thing, but I mean, it's right here in front of us and there's a beacon here as well. Go away. Stop pestering me, please. I'm trying to take this in that I've actually reached the end phase. Oh, oh my gosh. Wait, there's two diamonds here. Nice. Don't mind if I do. Oh, there's more than two. I think there's three. No way. I didn't even see that. I noticed the iron ore and then I turned around and there was diamonds. Let's build up to get this iron ore while we can. Oh yeah, look at this. There's plenty more ores where that came from. Okay, good stuff. I think we should head back up to the top and really just see what we can do with these diamonds. Oh no. Let's make a little staircase going up. Okay, like this. Let me just dig up. There's lots of stone brick here as well that we could take, but we don't really need it. I'm going to make a nice spiral, well, not a spiral staircase, but just a normal staircase leading upwards. I hope that little thing doesn't follow me up here and try and eat me. We finally reached the chunk that we was just at. I don't mind if I do take this. All right, so we can head back up now and go through everything that we just got and pretty much go from there, I think. The most important thing is we have a lot of diamonds now. I've actually found so many. Why haven't I tried finding diamonds before this? I would have probably been a millionaire right now. I would have been rich in diamonds. Okay, we've got to go up this waterfall first. Oh, there's lots of bone meal here. Oh, look at that beautiful axolotl here. Ah, oh, look at this sneaky little creeper here. You can't get us. Ha ha. Na 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 na. You can't get us. Well, let's go back up to the top like we was proceeding to do. Oh, hang on a moment. Before I forget, let me take some of this sugar cane down as well. There we go. What can we drop? Let's drop this ink sack. We don't need that. Okay, I think we collected all of the sugar cane, haven't we? Yeah, all right. Buddy's still chilling here, so we'll leave him to it. Please don't take... Oh my gosh. Why do they keep appearing in here? What is going on? What is so interesting? interesting about my one chunk what what is it go back <gasps> oh my gosh that could have been really bad. I gotta be careful on what I'm doing. That could have been terrible. Go back to your home. And these trees are really annoying me, so I'm gonna chop these down. Where's the furnace? Here it is. Okay, right. I've got a furnace here. Oh, well, make yourself at home, I guess. All right, let's go and smelt some of this so we can get some charcoal. All right, let's put it in here and then we get some charcoal and with the charcoal, we can smelt our iron. And also while we're at it, let's go and dump some stuff in this, ch oh, actually in this chest because the other one's full. We can make a music disc. There we go. Okay, let's take our candles and where can we put these? I'm going to put them in my barn. I might put some candles here and light them. We've got some candles going on. Let's put some candles in our home as well while we're at it. Light these candles up. There we go. We've got some candles on here now, which is pretty cool. Two candles here as well, like that. There we go. I don't know why. I'm just going to add them there just for some extra detail. So I'm going to proceed to do so. How's my cows getting on? You guys okay? What about you chickens? Oh, some eggs. Give me a baby chicken. Maybe not. Right, well, I'm going to head to bed now. Okay, it is a lovely new day. And also, I forgot we got an enchanted golden apple. So I'm going to put this in the food chest because we're going to need that against the ender dragon. We also got a swift sneak three enchantment book as well, which is interesting. Oh, look at that. Ten pieces of steak. What else can we cook? Let's cook some more beef. And then what else? We've got some golden carrots, some more golden apples. And I want to make a bow and arrow as well, actually, because I feel like that's more important. I think that's going to be the first thing I enchant is a bow. We'll also go and deposit this sugar cane into our chest. Okay, our shield's coping well, so we'll leave that for now. Oh, hang on a moment. We also got an ender pearl to put in a chest. But let's grab our diamonds and make our first diamond sword. Here we go. There it is. And boom, there we go. We have our first diamond sword. Let's go back and put all our valuables back in the valuable chest. My fresh diamond sword is ready for action. Whatever gets put in my way will be slayed. But before I do anything like that, I want to take my wheat. Can you move out the way, please? Oh, sorry, buddy. I mean, you kind of deserve that little slap anyways. He was getting too much in my way. Place this back down. This zombie pig man is getting way too comfortable. Let's push him down here. Go down the stairs, buddy. I want to try and push you back into the nether where you belong. Because you do not belong up here. No, don't go down there. Go down this way. Come on. Okay, hold up. Okay, you're so close. Go in your home. Go back. There we go. All right. He's probably going to return, but whatever. I might make some little stairs leading up to my nether portal. Yeah, I'm going to go and grab some stairs. Let's see how our iron's getting on. Okay, almost done. Let's go and make ourselves an iron axe. We need to clear some of these trees as well. Okay, and let's go back down here. Get rid of all of this wood. Okay, let's sort of clear this area. All right, and then let's take these stairs and then put them... Hang on a moment. Let's actually put them about here okay and then let's take some netherrack and then place it sort of down here let me take some of this netherrack behind here so we can go and place it about here all right so now we have a little access we might need some more netherrack actually be cheeky to take this down here maybe okay i'm pretty sure i've got loads of netherrack in my chest well my barrel even okay i only got nine i thought i had a lot more than that whatever there we go okay that looks a lot better now it's just sort of you know it's cleaner now so that's fine i don't think i have any i'm gonna have to smelt some of this into stone but my, all of my iron's done let me smelt some of this into stone and make some of this stone brick wall into the valuables barrel and put all of this iron in here brilliant 
Maybe I need to clear some sheep because there's quite a lot here. There we go. All right, how's our food getting on? Perfect. Let me go ahead and eat a piece of this. Perfect. Hopefully, we have some stone now. Okay, we've got five pieces. Right, let's take some of this and turn them into some walls. Okay, what can we do with this? We can build up like that. Okay, there we go. All I need is one more. Or should I just leave it like that, actually? I think it looks better. Yeah, maybe it actually just looks better like that. Okay, well, I feel like I need to push that more that side, don't I? So let me go up here and then... Hold up, this is just all temporary, okay? Okay, and then what we can do is we can put this stair here right wait how was it before was it like that whoops was it like that okay was it like this I'm not quite sure. We're about to find out. I think I just completely messed that up, but I mean, let's put this block of gold right here. Okay, well, I mean, it looks a lot better, so Hup! there we go. And then the other side, I'm surprised I actually just did that. Wow. Can we do it? Can I do it with this one? Hup! Oh, no. Let's try again. Hup! No. <laughs> last one. There we go. It's always on the last. Third time lucky. All right, well, there we go. We have a little nether portal in play here, so it looks more presentable. And I think it's sleepy time now. Beautiful sunset mornings. Don't you just love to see it? All right, let's put some of that raw mutton in there. And let's get chopping these trees then because they're quite annoying now. I'm probably just going to let them all grow. This is so satisfying how they all just break. I'm going to try and not collect the logs because then it, because then when all it drops, it's going to look like lots of loot. It'd be more satisfying to pick up. Feels more rewarding. Oh, yeah, that was a big one. There we go. Let's collect all of these goodies. And then let's place all of these oak saplings back to where they originally belong. Okay, let me grab more of those. Oh, my God. Gosh, place some of these back down and let that all grow now. Just just for decoration now, I think, because, you know, it's going to look really cool when it's all grown. So I think we've achieved a lot of great things on this one chunk. I think it looks really nice. We've got a nice barn going on here. We have our enchantment room. We can go and take a look at this. Some details added here and just your standard enchantment table. And then if we go around this side, as you all know, we have our carrot and potato farm followed up with some decoration on here as well. You know, just to give it that extra detail. By the way, I think we need to harvest this, but I don't think we need to. I think we're going to leave it because we got enough now. And then obviously we got our trees here. We go and take a look. A lot of them has grown now, as you can evidently see. But yeah, we're going to let all of this grow through. Have we got any bone meal by any chance? We've got bone meal somewhere somewhere haven't we there it is there okay so we've got two bone meal here so i mean we can maybe grow some of this you know got some got some grass going on now maybe we should cut the long ones though because they are quite long there we go right well let's make some oak slabs and then with these we can make a composter all right just like this and then let's place this hmm you know what? actually i'm gonna i'm gonna place this roughly about hmm where should i put this should i put this here yeah i'm gonna put it here right and then have i got any more kelp okay i don't think i do but i'm gonna take a lot of, a lot of these wheat seeds and put it in the composter and that's gonna give me lots of bone meal there we go i think we just need another piece of bone meal to be honest okay there we go so we got two pieces of bone meal now so we can grow more grass i'm gonna take the long pieces off though because i feel like that's too much just so it makes it more natural you know I, I actually really like it i think it's so cool right well oh no you're back again seriously what have i told you you're gonna be the first mob i slay with this new diamond sword there we go i feel like we need to prepare for the end so we need a bit more ender pearls and blaze rods so without that being said let's head back to the nether portal and see if we can find more endermen because they might have an enderman phase oh my wait a second where are you guys coming from are you guys oh gosh oh hello magma and blaze don't mind me buddy i'm just coming through okay okay we're gonna have to use wood in here because i forgot to bring cobblestone that was silly of me oh my gosh oh no okay we need a bow and arrow that's what we need uh oh i didn't mean to attack you uh oh okay, i need to go back oh my gosh oh okay okay please leave me alone i need to eat my steak in peace i'm getting attacked left right and center Oh, I, oh my gosh, it's just these skeletons. Oh, they're all following me up the staircase. Wait, what can I hear burning? I'm not quite sure, but I mean, let's just head down, I guess. Where did we dig down? Okay, it was here. Oh my gosh, let's get rid of you. All right, so we're going to have to go down here, aren't we? Wait a second. Oh no, we're going to have to make some fit. Oh no, 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 no. Do not come up here. We're going to have to make some, some like fence gates or something to stop them from all coming up here. So let's make a crafting table and I don't know, maybe just put it here for now. And then let's make a fence gate to avoid them coming up i'm gonna just place that here right <gasps> oh my gosh i thought it come in okay right leave me alone stop running away and coming back just take your defeat all right let's place more of this netherrack back down here yeah i mean why are you running away there we go all right let's close that behind us okay and we're back where we left off and there's a big hog there can it get up or not no okay it can't i'm so scared something's going to come up behind me but we need to get through this phase which is going to be a mission in itself right how do we get down originally oh my gosh 
Okay, I think we got down... Okay, it was from this side last time, wasn't it? So if we kind of go back through here... Oh, no. Okay, let's get rid of you. Oh, I nearly fell in there. Right, we're going to have to try and find a way back down. Okay, right. We need to go back down to our original staircase. Oh, my gosh. Stay back. I just got to be careful I don't get sneak attacked from behind or something like that. Come on, little buddy. Oh, okay. I got to make sure no one can get up here. No, so see, I got to break this so they can't get up here. Ow, that isn't nice. That's not how you treat visitors. All right. Hmm. Okay, you're down here. Oh, my gosh. Okay, there we go. Okay, we've got to make sure they can't just come up here when they feel like it. Where is that original staircase? I started building down. Uh, I think that's it, right? Oh, obviously not. Okay, I'm going to have to build a sort of enclosed mine leading all the way down. Oh my gosh, this guy wants to take me out. What is going on down there? So there sounds like an absolute army of them. Right, let me build this thing here so we're nice and safe. And then we can sort of like spiral down. Oh my gosh. Okay, you don't want to be accidentally falling down there, that's for sure. Look at this. What is this? Oh no. Oh my gosh. I didn't think he could hit us. Well then... I don't know what to say, really. I mean, actually, we can take these out here. Little XP farm, maybe? Oh, don't point that bow at me. Ow! This is actually quite good. We've got like a little XP farm here. Come in, my friends. Look at this guy. He's wait He's been waiting for me. Look at the little babies running around. Absolute menaces. All right. Oh, my gosh. Okay, surely there's no actual possible way of anybody coming up here, right? Just to be extra safe, I've got to take extra safety precautions here otherwise i'm dead meat there we go all right so oh my gosh look at this what the heck oh my gosh what is going on there's an absolute army of them what is that oh my gosh look at this well free xp for us i guess i'm not complaining to be honest this is just free xp for me give me your experience points i wish i could just get these guys but i can't reach what if i put a slab here instead of that like this can i get attacked from here no okay i can't but i still can't hit them which is really annoying Oh, okay. All right, well, we're going to have to block this off for now because I need to start mining down. Please. Okay. Sorry, little baby, but... Oh, okay. All right, there we go. Sorry, little guy. Oh, what is that? Let's chuck this down here. I want to pick that up. Potion of fire resistance. Okay, nice. Well, let's proceed digging down like what we was originally planning to do. Okay, right. Maybe we need some ladders. So let's go back up... Oh my gosh. How are you getting up here? Oh no. Right. Okay. Oh no. Guys, we are trapped. Oh my gosh. Oh no. We are so doomed. What do I even do in this situation? We need to come up with an idea here. Okay, so we're going to place this crafting table here. Okay. And we're going to craft ourselves some ladders. Right. And then we also need to craft ourselves a chest, which we can use. Okay, like this. And then we can go ahead and just put everything in here for now. And then take the stuff that we only need. Okay, so let's take some of this wood. And um, we got to take some ladders. Uh, what else can we take? Okay, we've only taken the stuff that we really need. So that's fine. Let me go ahead and eat this piece of steak. And we've got to use these ladders sometimes in order to get up and down. All I can hear is pigs snorting. I do not like this. Get me out of this chunk. Can you guys hear them? How loud they're being? Oh, here we go. This is the chunk that we need. And they all look so angry. Can you now see why I hate the nether? Because this is exactly why. It's the scariest place on earth. I don't know why anybody would even want to even visit this place. Alright, we need to go up and make a boat to put these endermen in. What's going on here? Wait, can I hit them through this gap? Oh, yes, I can. Okay, well, that's helpful. We've got like an XP farm going on here now. But this isn't what we came for. We came for the enderman's enderpearls. Oh my gosh! Well, drop me an enderpearl then, at least. No enderpearls from that guy. Okay, right then. Let's try and spiral down, being as careful as we possibly can be. Okay, we're gonna make a little two by two like so. Okay, don't mind me, enderman. I'm not looking at you yet, okay? There we go. Drop me your enderpearls. No enderpearls? Seriously? Right. Okay, let's spiral down this side, because I feel like it's more safer for us. Well, our axe just broke, which is great. Okay, oh no, we did get an enderpearl. Right, okay. How many more do we need again? I forgot to count, but I'm pretty sure... I don't know, we can never be too safe. We're going to try and get as many as we possibly can. I don't mean any harm. Well, actually, I do mean harm, because I do want your enderpearls, but ignore that, okay? I'm just... Just give me your enderpearls, okay? I'll, and I'll leave. I'll get out of here. I've got lots of angry endermen trying to get rid of me. Okay, come on. There we go. If I can just lure them all up here, and then they can just get in the boat, then... That'd be great. Right, let's go and collect our boat and try and drop down a little bit. Can we do that? I hate the nether so much. I need to get rid of this because it's obstructing my way. Oh, there's a couple of enderpearls over here. I'm not looking at you, enderman. I'm not looking at you. I'm not looking at you. I promise. I promise, okay? Now I am. Drop me an enderpearl. Come on. Yes, there we go. Let me take this boat up. Oh, okay. I thought it dropped down there for a second. Hey, buddy. How you doing? Don't mind me. I'm just, just coming through, all right? Go in there. There we go. Okay, let's take that boat back. Let's just keep repeating that. Go in the boat. Come on. Get in. There we go. 
Let's take some of this warp nilium up, or nilium, or however you say it, or and some netherrack actually, and then we're going to use this to cover the pit of lava, just in case we fall into it, because we don't want to be doing that, okay? Yeah, sorry about that, guys. I'm just getting, getting, yes. Getting into pearl. Don't mind me, guys. Don't mind me at all. Oh, ah, there we go. Perfect. All right, nice. Six ender pearls. Good stuff. Very good. Okay, you kind of stuck there. Oh, there's two in here. Okay, well, I'm going to break this block so you can come back up. Oh, well. Ah, let's see if we can catch him in the act. There we go. Well, that was silly of you, buddy. We've got eight ender pearls now. Is that enough? That is the question. Oh, yeah, because we already have ender pearls back at home as well. So I think that should be enough for now. We just need blaze rods. So let's try and head back up. Let's go ahead and eat some of this steak, though. I'm so scared for the end because I don't know how it's going to be because this is all one chunk, right? So is the end just going to be a one chunk? Like, I don't know how that's going to go down, but we're going to find out. And I hear some angry people up here. I might as well just put you in here. Bad enderman. Thanks for the end pearls, though. Okay, there's another guy here. I'm just going to mind my own business and not look at you. Okay, thank you. Oh, no. Oh. Wait, how are they getting in still? How are these guys still getting in here? I blocked it off, right? Yeah, what? How did he even... Okay, what? whatever. Okay, we're going to have to look for a solution. We're going to have to block ourselves in like we've been doing. Uh, uh, uh. There we go. Right. So, if we make another ladder, let's make some sticks first. Okay, then keep making some ladders. We're going to have to do a little bit of parkour here. Oh! Oh my gosh. They're above us as well. All right. We need more netherrack. That's our problem. <gasps> okay. This is why we've got to be careful, guys. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. Let's go. Let's go. Go, 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 go. Let me go through here. Okay, we made it up alive. Okay, I hear skeletons, though, so I've got to be careful about those. Screw it. Come on. Oh, no. No, 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 no. There we go. There we go. All right, come on. Ow. Okay. Let's eat some of our steak real quick. Okay, let's quickly head back up to the top. Let's go. Oh, wait. I'll pick that enchanted bow up, though. What was on that? Oh, power one. Look at that. That's cool. Decent. How are we working this? Oh. Almost fell. Okay, I don't even care at this point. Just get me home. We got what we needed. Oh, no. Hang on a minute. We need we need blaze rods now, don't we? Oh, great. Now we've got to take on these guys. We could just drink our fire resistance potion, but honestly, I don't think we're going to be needing them. D did I just hear a ghast? Wait, what? Where? Where could a ghast possibly be here? I don't want to see a ghast. Where is this ghast? I'm so scared. I don't like this. Where are the blazes? Why aren't they spawning? There we go. Finally. Drop me your blaze rods, please. I have no idea where this ghast is. Where even is it? Here we go. All right. Some more blazes, nice. Keep spawning, blazes. There we go, All right? We take your blaze rod. That's what we need. We might have enough blaze rods, actually. Let's go and check. Let's go check back home. Oh, home sweet home. What is that? I knew I could hear a magma somewhere. I knew it. I told you. Okay, ignore that for now. Let's go back up to the top. Oh, finally, home sweet home. Oh my gosh, I love this place. Okay, well, let's go into our nether chest and let's go and put some more nether stuff in here. Yeah, okay, so we've got six blaze rods. So is that enough? We're about to find out. Right. Okay, so now what we can do is we can put the blaze rods in here, take them all for blaze powders and then make an eye of ender. So... Let's just make eight, nine of these guys. That should be enough, surely. All right, here we go. We've got nine eye of enders. So I believe that should be enough for the end portal. But we need to prepare for this battle. I also need to enchant my diamond sword. And it looks like I need to rebuild some of my armor because I don't want that breaking in the nether. What are we working with here? Oh, we actually have four ender pearls in here as well. So there you go. Okay, let's make a new helmet. Okay, let's take all of this off, I feel like. We need to make a new chest piece, definitely. Okay, what else? Leggings are fine. Honestly, boots are fine as well. So, yeah. Let's eat a piece of this steak then and prepare for the battle. Okay, seriously, again? What have we told you about entering without our permission? Come on now. I'll take your XP, but listen, just don't let it happen again. But I went ahead and made myself a fresh bow, and I'm going to go give it an enchant and see what sort of enchantments we can get on this. So, first of all, actually, I need to grab a piece of lapis. Where is it? I had it somewhere here. I must have put it in my valuable chest if I remember correctly. Okay, I have no idea what I did with my lapis. Well, this is nice. Where did I... Huh. What did I do with that? Did I not... Am I not seeing it? Okay, I have no idea what I did with my lapis. It looks like I'm going to have to go down and try and collect some then. Well, I didn't expect this to happen. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to go and collect some lapis. And after we've done so, I'm going to enchant this fresh bow I have in my hands here. And see what sort of enchants we can get on it. I'm hoping for infinity and there's lapis. So, enough yapping. I'm going to build up to this piece of lapis up here and collect it. I'll also take the XP while I'm at it as well. Because that all contributes. Okay, and that is absolutely perfect with me. So now we can happily go up. Well, I was expecting a long journey to find Lapis and like, oh, okay, there's literally Lapis up there as well. But I was expecting to come down here and be searching for ages for Lapis, but thankfully we managed to collect some. So now when we head back up to the top, we're going to actually, first of all, let's go to sleep. 
I know sheep, quiet down, I'm going to sleep, don't worry. Let's head back up to the top, go to the enchantment table and put my bow and lapis in and see what we can get. I'm praying for infinity, honestly, I just really want infinity, please. Oh, look at this, power three, flame and unbreaking three. What an enchant. I can still hear that gust and I have no clue where it's coming from. It's obviously below here, but I just can't seem to see it. Well, I'm still going to head down here anyways. Okay, wait a minute. Oh my gosh, wait, is that it there? Oh my gosh. What is this doing here? Skeleton now is not the time. What the heck? Oh my gosh, look at this thing. It's huge. Okay, I'm going to have to go down eventually, so... Okay, we got the gas at least. Oh my gosh, these skeletons. Come on, fight each other. No? You guys want to team up against me? That's no problem. I thought we was friends, but whatever. But I'm going to eat my piece of steak now. I thought I could hear a gas, but I had no idea it could get there. Uh, and of course, we got another pig man. Come on. All right, let's get some XP down here then. Oh, right, okay. I said I wasn't going to go back to this place, but I lied. Okay, well, I thought it'd be a good idea to come back because there's no way I'm risking anything down there. That is too scary, but we're now level 30, so let's go ahead and put our diamond sword in here, a bit of lapis, and sharpness 3. Okay, that's... That's not that bad. We'll take that. But I'm going to go down, grind some XP for a little bit, and yeah, let's uh, get some enchants. Oh yeah, now we uh, now we look like the business. We can't enchant the iron leggings, but it's okay. That's not going to make a lot of difference, right? But now I think it's officially time to prepare for the end. So let's grab everything we need. That includes lots of food. So let's take some golden carrots, even our enchanted golden apple. The normal golden apples, let's take... We need lots of blocks, so we're going to take this some stone here. We're going to leave the lapis here. We're going to take Take some torches with us we're gonna take our fire resistance potion even though we don't need it but i feel like it should come with us so let's just gather like loads of blocks cobblestone for example yeah let's take some wood with us as well actually why not and then let's take some water buckets with us too let's take two water buckets with us because you can never be too sure i'm gonna eat a piece of this steak right now okay so what do we need we've got enchanted gear we've got our sword bow after grinding for absolutely ages down here we've got the resources exactly what we need we've got all of our necessities now it is time to face the ender dragon. So where do we leave off? Right, was it down here? I've never been so nervous for an end before. I know, I don't know how this is going to be because this is one chunk and like, I really have no idea how it's going to work here. Let's just hope we get through this okay. So down here we go to the skulk chunk and then I believe, where do we dig down to? Oops. Yeah, okay, it was over here. Right, let's eat this piece of steak. I'm so nervous. Okay, just making sure I did bring my eye of enders which I have, so it's fine. But here it is. This is the moment you guys have all been waiting for and we're finally done it so let's get placing then so it was one oh my gosh you got to ruin the moment haven't you get out of here i'm gonna i'm gonna break this right get out Okay, right. As we were saying, here we go. Let's go. Oh my gosh, we just got enough as well. We had three left and look, there's only three pods left. So one, two, here we go. Here goes nothing. Oh my gosh, we got it. Here it is. The end portal was here. Wish me luck, guys. Please wish me luck because I'm going to need it. Well, let's dive straight into it then, I guess. Oh my gosh, look at this. Okay, let's get building. Let's get building quick. As soon as we hit trying to destroy us, so let's run back. Okay, I wasn't expecting this. Look at it. Okay. Oh my gosh, this is risky. I'm going to have to keep looking back and making sure he isn't trying to kill us. Oh my gosh, did you see that Enderman go flying? I'm going to build a massive thing leading up like this. I think this is the safest thing to do, to be honest. Right, let's keep building then. Oh my gosh. Okay. Has the Ender Dragon seen us yet? Or there it is. Oh my gosh. Wait, maybe we can go ahead and... Oh my gosh. Okay, it's good with flame because you can actually see where you're uh, shooting. So, okay, let's see if we can get this one. Can we get it? Okay, nice. We got that one. Can we get this one? Oh my gosh. We've got to be careful with this. Very risky stuff. Right. Let's keep going, though. Let's keep going. The dragon's flying away, so that gives us much more time to build up. I'm so pleased I brought a lot of materials, because I knew I was going to be needing them. Look at it. Okay, let's see if we can attempt... Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Look at the Enderman. Okay, I'm not sure I'm going to hit it from there. Oh, my gosh. Wait, I did. What a shot. Can we try and get this one as well? Oh, gosh. Okay, i got to be so careful here. I'm going to put a bucket of water down here. Oh, gosh. Okay, just in case I have placed a bucket of water here in case we do actually get knocked off. How long does it take to this stuff to go? Um, is it going to go anytime soon or are we just going to be stuck here? Oh, right, let's keep going then. we got no choice. I don't know where the dragon is and that is scary because I don't want it to fly into us and knock us off. So, I don't know what to do here. Right, let's keep going though while we can. Oh, gosh, I hear it coming back. Where is it? Come on. There we go. Right, we got it. Yep, it's coming. Oh, run. Mind your own business, bro. Oh, I don't want it to fly into me. All right, let's go. Let's go. Whoa. 
Oh my gosh! That missed us by seconds. Can we try and get this? Nice. Wait. There we go. Right, we got this one. Where else? Come on. Before the dragon comes back. Okay, we got this one. Come on. Yes! Okay, we got this one as well. That's just the last one. Oh my gosh! We've got to find a way to build over here. Let's try and distract the dragon. Or just mind your own business, buddy. Okay, what do we do here? we just got to build over, right? That's all we can do. Come on. Go, 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 go. Come on. We're almost there. We need to eat a piece of steak or something. Come on, that's right. Go down, go down. Yes. Okay, now he's distracted. <gasps> I'm so scared in case it flies into us. Let's make a run down. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We need to get out of here real quick. No, I'm trapped. Let me out. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Quick. we got to go up. we got to go up. Oh, it's right below us. Oh, my gosh. Well, that is so close. All right, let's get rid of it. Nice. Okay, that's the last one over there, I believe. This is so difficult. Why is it so hard? Okay, let's keep going. Let's keep going. Good job I brought loads of blocks because I was definitely going to be needing it. Let's keep going, though. We're not scared of you, dragon. This is the riskiest thing I've ever done. This could be all over these 100 days right now if this ender dragon just literally goes into us. This is why we've got to be careful right now. This is super risky. My nerves, my palms are literally sweating. Oh, gosh. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. Keep going. We're almost there. We're almost there. And then we can start taking shots at the dragon. Oh, my gosh. Come on. Oh, my I'm so scared. Bro, I'm so scared. Ah, I don't know where that went, but I'm going to try and avoid it. Okay. Oh my gosh, look at that. Okay, we're going to have to just go down and risk it. Come on, this has got to be it. Right, there we go. That's it. Now we can start defeating the Ender Dragon. Come on, let's go. Come on, I need a clearer shot like this. This is perfect. Come on. Yes, let's keep going. Oh, yes. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Nice. Oh my gosh, this is doing so much damage right now. I've got to be careful no Enderman try and attack me. Oh my gosh, look how close it is. Oh, that was close. No, 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 no. Why is it so hard, though, to actually try and get a clean shot off? Come on. So unpredictable. Yes. Okay, come on. This is where we get the most shots. Come on, let's go. We don't want to hit them Endermen, though, because they all come up. Okay, we're supposed to go down there and hit it, but... I mean, you know, it's kind of risky right now. Where are you going, buddy? Come on. All we got to do is keep landing those clean shots, and they deal so much damage. Look at it. It's just it's slowly trickling down. Good job we have a bow and arrow, isn't it? Oh, wait. He's going back down, I think. Let's go. Come on. Oh, wait. Let's go. It's nearly, it's nearly eliminated. Let's keep going. Oh, my gosh. He's one shot. Please. Yes! Yes, we got it! Let's go! Oh my gosh, let's go, baby! Finally! We defeated the Ender Dragon after 100 days. Let's go! I'm so happy. Look at the XP. Look at the pool of it. Unfortunately, I didn't actually go and collect that, which I kind of wish I did, but it's fine. Guys, we actually did it. Oh my gosh, you don't understand what a relief this is. I'm so happy right now. Let's go. I'm going to dive straight back into this portal and get out of here. I never want to see this place again. Well, maybe if I make a 100 days, I can go and explore the end cities, but for now, I'm going straight back to my cozy bed. It really was a good job I brought all these materials back with me. Otherwise, I literally would have been doomed, but let's go. We made it back. We did it, guys. We survived 100 days on hardcore Minecraft in one chance. Chunk. And after every 100 days I make, I get a little bit sad because the time and effort I really do put into these videos and especially these Minecraft worlds is just absolutely insane. And every single like and subscribe on this video, I will appreciate it, put it that way. Goodbye villager friends for now. Oh, I also got a farmer, I didn't even realise this. See you later fisherman and farmer for now. And let's give one last preview of our world. Well, we have our barn, we had our tree farm, we also had our carrot and potato farm which looks absolutely gorgeous. And also we have our little enchantment area, a little library here. Well, it's definitely been an honour. And there we have it. We have successfully survived 100 days of hardcore Minecraft in one chunk. If you have enjoyed this video, please feel free to drop a like, subscribe, and also leave a comment on the video regarding whether you enjoyed it or just let me know what you're doing. Definitely make sure you subscribe if you're new though because we're growing every single day and the Scoops army is becoming bigger and bigger each and every single day. But without that being said guys, I appreciate everybody watching and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.